Hello, 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 hello. How's it going? How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're enjoying the start of your week. Today, we are starting this brand new week off with a brand new game. We are checking out Star Fox Adventures for the GameCube. Um, so, okay. In, in the tags, it does say, and I think, yeah, I do have first playthrough. But I think I probably have played this. I mean, I know I definitely have played this at some point, like during my childhood. It's been a long time, though. I'm not really going to remember anything. So, you know, if you're expecting oh, top tier memory gameplay, no. <laughs> it's basically a first playthrough. Um, but yeah, it can be interesting because this is sort of. I mean, sort of, this is like the, the very standout game in the Star Fox series. Um, it's. Completely different from all the other ones. It's certainly completely different to the ones I've played so far. That is, it was just sort of joining us on my journey to go through the Star Fox series in. Um, I guess I'm going in release order, but it's, I guess, chronological order. I mm, we played Star Fox one and two, and uh, we played Star Fox sixty four. So yeah, you know, we've we've had played some played the the on rails sort of standard on rail shooters that we've had so far and now we're getting to the very weird one <laughs> the sort of time when i guess nobody was really sure what they were expecting from star fox anymore because it just got all wacky but not like wacky wacky it just got different <laughs> but yeah so I, I suppose we'll find out how how this all happens and how this all uh how we feel about this? <laughs> how, we, how we feel about it? We're going to find out how we feel about this game today, okay? You already talked about how you feel today. So, <laughs> we're going to check this game out and you know, see how, how it holds up after fuck, tw 20 years now. I'm, I'm staring at the touch screen. 2002 copyright. It's been 20 years since Star Fox Adventures. That's actually going to be curious though. I, I want to see like the date of this. See how close we are to like the anniversary. Okay, closer to September, so we're, we're a little bit shy. We're sort of probably closer to like 19 and a half years, but ignore that. 20 years, celebrating 20 years of, I don't know, whatever this game has to offer. <laughs> so let's jump into it, let's go. Also, hey, Decca, how are you doing today? This is fun because, um, so I was like, you know, making sure I had everything because I haven't played like a standard definition, like Wii game or anything or GameCube game in quite a while. So, you know, I, I like set this up a bit early, making sure, um, everything was fine. Everything looked good on stream. You're doing good, that's good to hear. This is Rob64 on the GameCube, yeah. Um, and yeah, I was like, while I was just t testing it, uh, my, my niece came in and she, she was just like completely infatuated with like the menu screen. So she was just like sitting here going like, oh, bunny, bunny, oh, wake up, bunny. <laughs> she just sat here just like going back and forth, getting uh, peppy. To like fall back asleep and then waking him up again <laughs> and then going back and then falling asleep and then waking him up again <laughs> it's like my niece is just like doing that for like for quite a while how old is she she's um a little over two now she's like two and a couple months that's two and a couple months not in a couple months you're two this january i believe <laughs> um <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh, we're gonna keep waking him up. He's not gonna get any sleep. No, nope, wake up. I was like, I don't know. I was. I think we'll go with normal because this does have like a kind of widescreen thing. But I was like, I, I, I can't, I can't tell which one looks better. But I, I think the general thing is that normal, like widescreen, kind of gets a bit wacky. So. Anyway, let's 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 jump in. Ooh, we get a thing. Do I get lowercase? I don't. I 
I think that's the thing with like what you're supposed to do for the widescreen is you're kind of supposed to like stretch I, I guess if you're capturing it anyway is you're supposed to like stretch it manually so like you know on, on this end it just still stays in like the four by three ratio oh and from the depths of space a girl named crystal searches for the truth of her parents death finding herself within a lost corner of the lilac system she receives a distress call from a world known as dinosaur planet i hope you got that last bit because i didn't um but yeah but the, uh, like the, apparently there's a problem where like it doesn't but the widescreen doesn't um it doesn't like change like the ui so you had like you stretch the ui along with the game it's very weird so we'll just stay we'll just stay normal okay oh no my staff <laughs> yeah, yeah, we, we got the the uh, the awakening for many a furry here. This is, you know. <laughs> it's the 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 curse of a generation. <laughs> oh, and we're in. I like no okay. I want to see if I like the controls feel very weird. But I guess I don't know, I guess I can't die in this section since it's the opening. Oh wait, am I supposed to like light that? Yes, yes, I was. Okay. I was like, you know, trying to like, um, destroy that and then, like, oh no, I had like already done it, I guess. Yeah, so, um, God, I just, the fact that I know that, that like, this fireball is like, is a stock sound effect bothers me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like obviously, I get you know I get that games and shit are gonna use stock sound effects, but I don't know, like like to me because to me it's kind of funny when like you recognize like a stock sound effect you briefly. Like one of my favorite slash least favorite ones. I don't know. One one of the ones that I can almost always recognize is like the stock door sound effect. I like if I hear that I just go that's that fucking door sound effect again <laughs> um, <laughs> so it, it, and it so it's kind of weird if that's like a really a main like sound effect very bizarre your adventure begins Hell yeah. My Star Fox adventure begins. <laughs> Why couldn't they have gotten out a microphone and some fireball to record their own sound? <laughs> I know, like, classic lazy game developers. SMH, my head. <laughs> See if we can look under her skirt, mess with the camera. Hey, uh, you won't happen to be one of them, uh, one of them there furries that this game awakened, would you? I'm gonna pause buffer to, I don't know, upskirt. <laughs> okay, that bit's over. You don't actually really have, like, um, camera control, like, um, I don't know, I, I think obviously you can tell that, like, 
there'll be moments where you can kind of go, oh yeah, this did start as like an N64 game. Because the C-Stick does fuck all at the moment. Oh, the, no, because the C-Stick ends up getting used for like items later, doesn't it? We're going to do many things. The A button is a magical little button. Very cool. Can we jump in the fire? Where was the fire? You don't think Crystal Cow? <laughs> Uh, I can't jump in that fire, too big. Although, like, I don't know, because this game's been compared to Zelda quite a bit. So I'm, like, instinctively pressing A to, um... To what? To, like, to roll? But it's like, no, 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 you've got to press X to roll. Like, no, no, I don't want to press X to roll. I want to press A to roll. Hell yeah, we got the key. This is a key from the Krizoa Palace. When you pick up an item, it will be placed into your C inventory. Move C in any direction to display your inventory. Then push C left or right to rotate the inventory. Each slot will hold different types of objects. Like, I don't know, to me this screams sort of like... Y you know, like, like this is very like uh, the sort of thing that you... That would work well and kind of make sense on like the C buttons. For the uh, for the N sixty four controller. Oh shit! It's him. A guy. General Scales. He called Kohud or Taskuki if dinosaur planet. I'm dead, Kutsuho Kaipori Oi. I'm Edko Kutsuho Rosvejo Evu Tashkov Zook. That's a very bold move, I'll say. Like, if somebody introduces to you, to themselves to you as dictator, and you go, oh, I'm not here to fight. I'm here for a distress call. Like, I don't know, man. I don't think the dictator is gonna, like, <laughs> it's gonna quite be on board with whatever you're trying to do. Like, I don't think he sent out the distress call. Yeah, the language is a bit wacky. Bye bye. Aha, fur is defeated. <laughs> now Scaly's rooms rule supreme. It doesn't sound scales being in English, but they definitely have a word for general. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You gotta wonder, like, how much of it is, like, an actual language? And how much is, I don't know, just like fucking ad-libbed by the voice actor. Like if they had like, no, no, we need you to pronounce it like this. Or if they just like, I oh, just fucking, you know, similar shit up. And then we'll fucking... <laughs> and then, you know, we'll, I don't know, say that's good. Uh, yeah, I got a memory card. Yeah, press pause. I have a grand old time. Wonderful. <laughs> we got tentacles. We got fairy. It's all going to get. Now, what what kind of Star Fox game is this? This is one of them Star Fox games you find very um, on certain areas of the web. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Sup, dinosaur. The King Earthwalker sent us to protect Krozoa Palace. It's not safe for you here. <laughs> Don't yourself in danger. Press X to roll out the way. Yo, it's just like Dark Souls. Good. Good. Ouch. Okay. There you go. That's what happens when you tend to call it up. 
When the seed is displayed, you can use an item from your inventory. Move C in any direction and it will automatically go to the correct slot for you. Use an item, simply press A. Okay. Um. Oh, did you say anything useful? No, not really. He'd, he'd say, oh, I rolled with the expert and said, figure that out already, mate. Oh, hang on. Can I, like, no. I cannot pick these up. What was this supposed to be? Oh, wait, I still have that key. Does that... Oh, I'm a fucking idiot. I was like, oh, I already, like, used that key on the ship or something. I didn't. <laughs> These are tasty puck puck eggs, a sharp claw delicacy. Don't worry, they are not dinosaur eggs. They come from huge puck puck birds that the sharp claw breeds just for this tasty snack. Walk over the egg to collect and recharge your energy. Okay. Well, as long as they're not from dinosaurs, that's okay then. In all scales, and your sharp claw army attacked. Got to stop them, but there were too many. Take a look around before you went into an area. Press Z to see from head view. Oh. oh, I was like, if it was very quick, I was just gonna see if I could like mash the X, the the Z button. It was like, look, it's like first person. You should leave this place. Scales has brought a great evil into the palace. To be extra safe, sneak around corners by holding down the L and moving in the sidestep mode. <laughs> We tried to stop them, but they have opposable thumbs, and we don't. A doomed cause from the start, truly. To be fair though, it makes you wonder how they got up here. Oh. No, you silly bastards. Uh, I was going to call it a skeleton. It's like a jellyfish. I don't think even jellyfish have skeletons. Scales attacked the palace so that he could capture the Krozoa spirits for himself. The spirits hold great powers that have been safe within this palace for a million years. We fought hard against the Sharp Claw and were able to hide the spirits throughout the planet. Scales then unleashed an evil into the palace. In their hurry to leave, the Sharp Claw sealed me inside. G got, got him. <laughs> I feel like that doesn't quite add up because it's like, hang on, if they were in a hurry to leave, surely they wouldn't give a fuck if you were inside. Like, you know, like, like, it would make more sense, like, oh, in their hurry to leave, they didn't trap me. Not, oh, in their hurry to leave, they trapped me. <laughs> like, in the, they, they were so very hurry to, in, like, in a hurry to leave, so they locked me up. <laughs> and made sure I couldn't get out. Okay, um, where did I see, there was, like, a few crates somewhere. Did I see that? Right there. <laughs> like right next to where it was. You've collected a, a Dumbledang pod. A Dumbledang old pod. It's a delicious fruit only found on Dinosaur Planet. You will find them in sharp claw baskets and crates. Or hanging in Dumbledang trees. Even baddies will sometimes drop them. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have a wonderful dumble dang old time. Ow. Wait. Oh, really? Oh, don't tell me. I've... Oh, wait, no, no, because there was one here. Yeah. I was like, don't tell me. I've got to go all the way back to like the entrance area. <laughs>
Oh, you bastard. <laughs> this is a speaker and we can wait for the fire. Ah, oh, but I guess you're right. I don't know, man. People, people say bad things about this game. I gotta make sure it's over as quick as possible. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That, that's a that's that's japes, right? That's. <sighs> so I wonder what like I guess what stage we are, and like you know, the sort of like the wave of nostalgia going back in favor for this game. Like I don't know how it was viewed at the time. Um, like, you know, I, I, as a kid, like, this was the only Star Fox game I had, like, this was the only Star Fox game I played. I think my, my brother played the, the DS one, I think that was Command at some point as well, but, like, this was, like, the only Star Fox game we knew, so, um, you know, I, like, so, like, as a kid, I wasn't like, oh, man, this fucking deviates from the formula so much. Because I wasn't even aware there was a formula, you know? I was just like, yeah, this sure does exist. Um... But, you know, there's, there's sort of, like, things kind of go in waves. There's, like... <laughs> just associating this with Star Fox. <laughs> You know, things go in waves, but like, you know, people who like, like people who probably grew up with like the original Star Fox and it's like Star Fox 64 probably played this and were like, man, this fucking blows. This isn't Star Fox. This ain't hashtag not my Star Fox. Um. <laughs> Star Fox, the mediocre Zelda clone. I know the series well. Oh, no. Quickly, let me back up now. Whatever, whatever. Oh shit. Oh man, this guy's special. He got voice acting. Kill King Earthwalker shot each game. Hekas Kiaj Shu shot Fusuzo. Could see Mo Eve Kao Krizoa. I guess I can, but I probably can talk over these cutscenes because it's like, but you gotta read the subtitles. Like, like hang on, I gotta, I gotta be silent for the fucking dinosaur going. <laughs> <laughs> Though I think if he did that, he'd be like, oh shit, I set my game to Italian. Whoops. No work at Kokio Fiho if could suit. Um. Suit Kubo Kyo. Yeah, so, like, so, so I imagine like people who like grew up with like, you know, played the original Star Fox and Star Fox 64 when they were young, played this and were like, oh, what the heck is this? This is like completely different. Like, what? We're, we're tw 20 minutes in, 25 minutes in. No Star Fox! Where's the fox? Is that a fox? Foxes don't have breasts. No. Um. <laughs> but then, you know, but then, as I said, like, there are people like me who, like, this was their first Star Fox game as a kid. This was, like, you know, for the longest time, my only real experience with the Star Fox series. So there got to have been some people who like, you know, played this game and looked on it fondly. And then because of that sort of like, you know, the wave of nostalgia means eventually there are going to be people who like grow up. People who played this game while they were growing up have now grown up and they could be like, oh man, Star Fox Adventure was fucking fantastic. That was great. It's sort of the, you know, the sort of thing that you get with like Sonic games where you kind of like... <laughs> Like, I, I think if you would just consistently go through the Sonic games, you'd go like, like, it, probably once you get to 3D Sonic. I know that's not, that's like the coldest of the fucking takes, but, you know, once, at least once you get to like Wii era Sonic, you're like, wow, these are shit. But there are people who grew up with those ones, but they won't say that. <laughs> They're not going to go, wow, this one's shit. I was like, no, I played this game when I was a kid. So it's a, it can't be shit. 
You know, I, I, and I was like, I don't know if we've got to that point with this one because like, because I think like th this is probably like the one that you're most likely to hit that with. But I feel like that hasn't happened at all with any of the other Star Fox games. Like, you know, like what the one after this was Assault. And it's like, I don't know whether Assault was like well received because from what I can tell, that is a more traditional Star Fox game. And kind of the same with Command. But you just don't hear about them. You know, maybe that's on part of like Nintendo for like only ever releasing Star Fox 64 <laughs> over and over and over again. Or <laughs> just doing rehashes of Star Fox 64. This is a life force door, the spirit floating on it. I don't know how many bad guys you must defeat before the door will open. I saw it wasn't well received, but you loved it. Okay. I mean, yeah, it's one of those things where you just don't really hear about, like, a, like, like you hear, you obviously hear about, like, Star Fox, and you hear about Star Fox 64. Fuck, I'd say you even hear about, like, Zero at this point more than you hear about, like, Assault and Command. Like, those ones just kind of happened. <laughs> and people were just like, mm, whatever. Played the verses for hundreds of hours in major and meta. <laughs> I think that's the thing. I think I think something a lot of people have said is that like this probably would have ended up being better received if it was just like released as Dinosaur Planet rather than a Star Fox game. But I mean... Mm -hmm. Interestingly, the bazooka was the best weapon. But it was safest to be in an R-Wing, but the R-Wing had collision. <laughs> get the Arwen going stand on it and shoot down with the bazooka I guess that, that was a weird thing that like I only recently really actually found out about assault like I didn't realize assault had like I guess like third person like on foot segments or that there was like, like that whole thing was like a part of the game like because I mean that's the thing you don't really hear a lot about assault so I was just like Oh yeah, it, you know, it was just a Star Fox game, and uh, I don't know, I guess after, like, Adventure, people just didn't care about Star Fox for a while. But it wasn't until, like, recently, um, that I, I, like, saw, like, a bit of it, and I was like, oh shit, uh, fucking... And, like, <laughs> there's, like, on foot segments? Damn. You get some friends over if you ever play it and do the multiplayer. The multiplayer makes the game. Then the only... No, I was, I was gonna say it's not the only Star Fox with multiplayer, but Star Fox 64 had multiplayer. I can imagine that would have been a thing I really would have liked if I was like when I was a kid as a Star Fox 64 multiplayer. We never had that one. What's the question when I heard from the end stop moving? You must show me which urn I have hidden in. Okay, so just remember. Remember which one he's in. Easy peasy. But I don't like. I don't remember how far I got into this game because, like, I mean, the last time I would have played it would have been so, so, so many years ago now. Um, but I remember I got stuck at like one of these puzzles. Not, not, not like these as in like I don't know the, the, specifically like this one where you got like watch where it goes well like the there are like these types of puzzles all over the game all right no problem decker thanks for stopping by
You did it. You collected the first Krizoa spirit. It will remain in your body until you take it to the Krizoa palace where it must be released. Has she still got the purple eyes? She has. Yeah. Very important detail. Okay. Oh, shit. Well, she was like, I, I don't know, was she like gonna go in the crystal anyway? Or was she like not supposed to go in the beam or I don't know. I don't really get that, I'll be completely, <laughs> completely honest. Like, it's not like his presence trapped her in the crystal. Also, haha, she's called Crystal and she's in the crystal. It's, uh, it's very clever, it's very good. Meanwhile! <laughs> oh shit, half an hour in, it's Star Fox time. I better, better change my game to Star Fox Adventures. Up and do uh Falco, where's he at? It's not at all not at all there. General Papa here! Your mission takes place on Thorntail Hollow. Locate the Queen of the Earthwalker tribe. She will help you further. Pepper out! Oh, 
For a second, I thought that was like the gold ring, and I was like, oh damn, that's easy! <laughs> that fucking easy peasy part of the game. I think that that, that is the gold ring. Right. I thought you said fly through one gold ring to get through dinosaur planet. Good job. But I kind of know that, you know, this one just isn't at all going to be like a normal Star Fox game. Because, <laughs> like, I, I haven't, like, played a, Star, played a Star Fox game for quite a while. So I'm like, oh, I, I kind of can't be asked to fucking... <laughs> I'm like, oh, I don't really want to play, like, a whole fucking Unreal shooter or whatever. Yeah, but I'll play a shitty Zelda clone. Except we don't know she's shitty, you know? First time playthrough, we don't know. It's all a mystery to me. I am fucking hilarious! You will open your communicator, choose who you wish to speak to, and then press the A button for oh, yes, I would like to speak to the Nintendo GameCube. will give you different information. It's not being tested in action, so give it a try as soon as I've finished. And don't forget, you're looking for the Queen Earthwalker. Try talking to those Thorntail guys. Flippy is preparing a translator device, but until it's ready, he'll translate for you. Okay, General. But what about a weapon? Why couldn't I bring my blaster? It's always the same with you, Fox. Shoot first, ask questions later. This mission is about saving the planet, not blowing it up. It requires a different tactic. Try using your head. <laughs> yeah, yeah, very funny, sir. Fox out. Yeah, try fucking headbutting everybody. Hello, stranger. I am a Thorntail. Gales has unleashed his army of sharp claw upon us. They have taken to the Queen Earthwalker and locked the doors. We are very worried about our safety. Let me give some advice about our world. All around us are many trees, some of which contain Dumbledang pods, a lovely, tasty fruit. Try finding a way to knock them out of the tree. They are a great source of energy. Go and speak to the other Thorntails. They have more info. Ah, uh, you can't roll into a tree. Zero out of ten. I understand why everyone hates this game now. Hello there, friend. To the side of me, you will see a circle of rocks. If you're very strong, you could try and lift them. Once the rock has been lifted high enough, watch carefully and what happens next. No, I'm too weak. Slippy here! Got yourself stuck again? <laughs> Sl Slippy, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing, Step Slippy? Hi, <laughs> folks, I'll be here to help you if you ever get stuck. What are you doing, Steph? <laughs> and I guess if you're talking to me, you must be stuck already. You need to f no, I just, like, they were like, hey, why don't you try talking to your fucking teammates? And I was like, yeah, okay, I guess I'll try that. And Slip was like, wow, you must fucking suck beans if you've already fucking decided to talk to me. I said, no, Slippy, I'm trying to be fucking friendly. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> God, he, he got a fucking windy picking up a staff. 
Like, I'm pretty sure he's supposed to be, you know, in decent shape. He's not supposed to be fucking me. <laughs> so why am I getting fucking Mario Teacher's piping flashbacks? And fucking crystal. I'm <laughs> gonna fly for you. <laughs> I think it's the fact that she's just like vaguely off to the side as well. I think. Oh shit! <laughs> I like entered that area the wrong way. Hey, you got any drinky? Okay, so combat at the moment is. We be pressing the A button. Ow. <laughs> Hell yeah. This will only play if my staff feels that you are ready to become its fast. I want you master my staff. Hey yo! I want, want you, want you feel my staff calling through your hands. Hey yo! <laughs> Why don't you, why don't you gem some energy in my staff? Hey yo, <laughs> that one didn't work, but that's that's the beauty of it. Right, who the fuck was like crying? Can you even see the like the character who's crying? Or is it like a ha ha eat shit moment? Oh fucking no. This is a bomb spore plant. Find a way to make it explode and it will throw out bomb spores to collect these spores as they will become very useful when you need to get through solid walls. Uh, I probably should have read that last section, but fucking oh well. Oh. I guess that's like a block. Okay. What's up, dude? Let's see here, just this tree. If you want some real help, you should go and look around the store. Over there, through that doorway. Go inside and take a look around. There are lots of items for you to buy. How are you, friend? Do you like my magic plants? They will give your staff energy to allow you to use extra abilities. You do have the staff, don't you? Anywho, chop down and collect the energy that they will drop. And don't worry, they'll grow back soon. I'm like skipping over words and it's like confusing me. <laughs> I'm like, this doesn't make any sense. Yeah, because you're not reading it properly, you fucking dumbledang. Mumble, 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 not now. Alright. This way to Snowhorn Waste. But why do I think just the worst things to say? Like, like it's not even like, oh man, this would be like, oh shit, I shouldn't say this. But like, like I was gonna say, why don't you, why don't you wasting my snow? <laughs> it's like, no, no, I'm, I'm ending that bit. This is a rocket boots pad. This is a boots upgrade. You'll see it when you have it. Yeah, I don't have it. Oh shit, it's the thorn tail store. For all your thorny tail needs. Welcome to my store. Feel 
free to look at the many wonderful items within these walls. I have food, special goods, and many maps. And if you like to play games, then enter the Scarab Room. Yes. Oh, and that's yes. it. Yes. Uh, okay. Yes. <laughs> now, if you find something that you like, then choose that item and we'll discuss a prize. Is that clear? Well... Good! Now, hurry and choose something. Or oh, get out! Hurry and choose something. Or oh, get out! That was the weird thing this game has. It has like, I don't know, I guess like a barter system where you like haggle with the shopkeep. Which is like interesting, I guess. It's like kind of neat. Um, I remember hearing it wasn't exactly done brilliantly. But I, I don't know. We'll, we'll, I'll, I'll find out for myself eventually, I'm sure. Oh, hang on, let's, uh, let's like try and what, flip these rocks now. Yay! This is a scarab. They're the currency of Dinosaur Planet and can remain different values. More valuable the scarab, the harder it is to catch. Now you find a scarab bag, you can only t carry 10 scarabs. Oh. And I've already got five. Cool. And now I've got ten. I'm uh, probably not rich, but you know. Okay, okay. Can't tell if that's like a, a guide on to like where to go, or if that's just like. No, I think it is. And I can't tell if that, that's like a guide on where to where to go. If that's supposed to be like a compass, I'm like oh that's north. And it's like no, I, I think that's like go that direction. That was just like look very cool thing over there. Can you like climb up that? No, you can't. Okay. Bomb plural, pl bomb, uh, blum, 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 blum. Hello, yes, I would like to learn to read, please. This is a bomb spore planting patch. Plant a spore here and see what happens. Gee, I sure would love to, but I don't have that. These are like being stored. General Pepper here. I'll display your current mission status. 
Can run pepper here, you fucking suck. Oh, there you go. I guess I went to the right place eventually. <laughs> You've collected your first staff upgrade, the Fire Blaster. With power from the energy crystals, it can be used for many tasks. Move C, stick to activate and menu and highlight. The upgrade then press A to use it. If you need to use it quickly, assign it to the Y for instant access. Okay, I shall I shall do that. Oh, that's a bit jumpy. So the same same sound effect. I like, how, like, the, like, the, like that hole is like barely the size of Fox and then this hole is like fucking massive I have to fucking out get off me what the fuck I guess I don't have ammo. Maybe actually no, do I? I don't know, that might be the thing that's like underneath my health bar. I don't know if I have ammo. No, don't fucking do this shit. Wasn't even a pointing coming up here yet. Wonderful. Freaky little fucking laughing guys. But, uh, it doesn't seem like you can lock onto, which is bogus. <laughs> No, what, what, what fuck doing in the water there? What's what is that? Freaky. Oh, the other two went wonderful. Hang on. Uh, God damn it! I thought somebody had options. No. I need to try and uh, see if I could like inverse the fucking aiming. No. No, no inversing the aiming. I'm kind of eating shit health wise. <laughs> oh, debated. Wait, what? Uh, I've got like a little health bar. Oh, fuck. Get out of there, fox. Oh, good.
<laughs> fucking bean some fucking mushroom. I don't even get to know what it is. What is it? Ah yes, feed to Tricky. But there is no Tricky. I don't actually know which way I came from. Okay, I think. Yeah. Oh, shit. Wake up. Somebody coming. Let's fucking Donkey Kong get up. <laughs> Quick, somebody coming. Throw fucking every single barrel we have at them. Every single barrel. Every single barrel. We have so many barrels that throw every single barrel. Every single one. Okay, why don't I get to know what that is? Use fuel cells, like, okay. He's more than happy to tell me, like, the little staff spots that I can't use. Heaven forbid I pick up an item that he didn't really want me to get. <laughs> yeah, was I supposed to pick up a key? But, what if I just, you know, like, this is wood. I can definitely bust this fucking door down. But I guess not. I mean, at least they've got a sense of like, I don't know, barrel preservation. Like, 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 if I get too close, they'll, they'll stop. They'll be like, okay, no, we, we don't need to throw the barrels anymore. He's, like, we've, we, we've missed him. We haven't, like, he's got, he's gone past us. But then if I, like, get back in, like, I don't know, like, barrel distance. <laughs> they're like, quickly throw the barrels again. He's running away. Throw the barrels. Oh, yeah, like, uh, unless I, no, no key. So I can't get in here. So, yeah, I guess, bye bye. So I guess I came here for nothing? That doesn't seem right. Like, this definitely feels like the where they want you to go. But, I mean... Good. Good. Okay, let's ask Slippy for help. Slippy here. Got yourself. Come back when you need me. Slippy. General Pepper here. I'll display your current mission status. Peppy here. Scanners in the... Check the detail readout, Fox. I think it might help you. Eh. I mean, years ago, the second moon of dinosaur planet can crash into the ground, bringing with it strange creatures from space. The mutant race of dinosaurs called Sharp Claw. No, Check no, that, di that didn't help, man. I think it... 
Keep going. Keep going, Fox. Oh yeah, keep going. Ah. <laughs> Why am I doing this again? I like there doesn't seem to be a key. So I can't get in yet. Okay, I'm just not going to be here anymore. I'm going to leave. I thought my game crashed then. I was like, wow, really? Okay, so I'll say all I've really learned is that I don't know, I couldn't, couldn't really go down there. Fuck off, dude. Oh my god. And the, these guys fucking suck. Uh, how much was like. Was there like a map I could buy or something? Probably. Whether or not I can actually afford it. <laughs> Bomb dad holder. Wonderful. No one artifacts. It poor map. Rock candy. I find this high high def display but device. Tricky's ball. Crusoe Palace map. What what would what is the point of buying the Crusoe Palace? I I guess you go there at some point again. Yeah, okay. Oh, get out! Get out! <laughs> well, I guess I'll buy this one. You pay this much. Oh, but how about I pay this much? <laughs> you pay this much? How about this much? No, fuck off! <laughs> I was like, oh, come on, dude, it's like one cheaper. No! <laughs> Get out of this room. <laughs> no, you broke something in my cave, did you? I fucking kick your ass now. <laughs> Transport, fuel cell, grub tub fungus. Fuck, fuck. 
kegs. You don't happen to sell like a bigger wallet, do you? I guess not. No. I not not only do I not have that, <laughs> I didn't. I don't have the money. I am paying a cheat. Fuck you, buddy. A cheat for free. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not entirely sure that map was worth it. And uh, I was like, wow, I sure do see. I don't fucking know the landscape I already see. <laughs> cool. Right, my fucking. Where, where did it de equip my fire blaster? Ah, ha ha! Cloud, and you must be the Queen Earthwalker. No, no, rude, no, Kadu, ve, uwe, moje, Prince Tricky, Kiog, rude, suf, ke, hot, ro, kio, shat, claws, ut, kubot, ki, I, he face palm so hard he broke his fingers. You slippy? You've got to go to the ice mountain and rescue her son, the Prince Tricky. <laughs> nice name. Okay, lady, I'll bring your son. Why did he do like that? Uh, can you give me some directions? Well, he gave a little weird little creeper face to her. Oh, and Mish Wiki Kill Warpstone. Kutsu Kutsuj Wok Fennel. Utsujod Oe Kill. You've got to talk to that big stone guy. She called him a Warpstone. That's all I need to know. I'll be back soon, Queen. Don't you worry. Haven't you finished that translator yet? It's nearly ready, Fox. I just need a bit more time. Slippy out. But apparently she understood the way. Like, Slippy didn't need to translate for her. That's always a fun, weird thing to, like... I don't know, just see. Is when, uh... Yeah, you know, like when, when, like somebody clearly like understands a language, but they can't talk it. So somebody just like talks, like at someone else, and it's like, oh, there's like clearly intended to be like a language barrier here, but fucking, oh lol. <laughs> like, like one of the characters will just understand what the other one's saying, despite apparently needing a translator. Why did I use two? I picked up three. Okay, well, yeah, like, <laughs> I was like, oh, well, I'm not expecting him to have like a wacky accent. He'll just, you know, speak in that sort of like, oh, everybody's from the old world. Do what you give up with the game, biggie. Lily Dinosaur talk. But I was kind of, I was like, oh, man, this is like, I, I was thinking, oh, but this would be like a really good, like, Oh, this is where Rareware could bust out like their fucking northern voices, you know. It's like, hey, up is your fucking rock, man. You're out right there, Fox. You need a warping to, a warping to the place. I was like, no, no, we, we won't do that. 
We just, uh... Instead he's, you know, fucking Mike Myers in Shrek. Door, but if you see any egg snatchers, be sure to get them. Why don't you go talk to the warp stone? Why don't you fucking warp my stone? <laughs> when you snatch my eggs. Nobody ever brings me gifts anymore. Okay, well, what would you like? Would you like a fungus? No. Would you like? That's kind of it, that's all I have for like gifts and fungus. <laughs> like I guess I can go get you some more bomb spores. If you're into that. He wants as a gift. I don't know. Fucking get him some fucking haggis or something. Okay, you bring me haggis, shall we, fox bastard? Yeah, we little fox, they can't. <laughs> I'm kind of expecting to, you know, be in water. Not just fucking take damage there, but okay. What, what does Peppy recommend? Slippy here. Got yourself stuck again? Why don't you look around? Why don't you really, okay, why don't you look around in the score? Score. Would you like a map? <laughs> fucking no, lady. I fucking am stuck to the ground. I'm not fucking going nowhere! I oh, don't know, uh, shopkeep, what do you recommend? I like that little yes he did. No, it's not like, not real yet. Although, good to fungus, fuck, fuck, egg, fuck, fuck, egg, singular. Uh, Dumble dang, pods, Dumble dang, pods, singular. What the rocks like? Oh, a uh, rock candy. You pay this much. You pay this much. I bought a pain that. Yeah. No, no, it's too low. Okay, I'll sell it to you. We have a bartering system, but pretty much all you can do with it is pay more. <laughs> uh, ah, yes, uh, wonderful. Okay, thank you. The perfect use of a bartering system is, you know, allowing me to pay more than I would actually like to. Not less, no, no, that would be stupid. I kept trying to think, I was like, there was another game that I played like somewhat recently that had like a bartering system, it was Tingle. That was like an entire fucking game based around bartering. 
as well. I guess that's like that's one of my cautious of bartering systems. At least with this one, it goes, here's the price, and you can go, no, I want to pay less. But, you know, and then you just go, no, fuck off! Nobody oh, brings me gifts anymore! Bring me a fucking rock candy, ya wee little prick. Ah, lovely sweetie. Mm. That is fucking tiny. Right, then you should be fucking ready to socialize for a bit. Uh, well, can you help us? <laughs> help you? No. But you're a warp stone. You're supposed to help. Ah, uh, right. Let's see if I can remember what I'm supposed to do. Okay. Now, if you push left on the control stick, then I'll send you to one of those warp stone thingies. We'll get back to that in a minute. And if you push forward on the control stick, then you can enter the maze. Ugh. Ah, now this one's a bit special. When you have collected a Crusoe spirit, then push right on the control stick, and I'll send you to Crusoe Palace. I'll now, fucking burst you! Know what I do. So hurry up and make a choice. If not, then press B so I can get back to sleep. Fucking Are you ready, Ice Mountain, I guess. Y yes. <laughs> Whoa, trippy. Are you ready to fucking hallucinate your fucking tits off? The foxes even have tits. Oh, yeah, there was a uh, there's a blue one with tits earlier. Oh, all right, you are then. Oh no, violence. Huh? No. They're gonna let me in. What a shame. Can I? There's like clearly a fucking thing here. Can I have it? No, I guess. Okay. Fuck me then. There's more thing, but I genuinely hate uh, being fucking. Um, no, I don't want a fucking cheat token. Well, that, that, that basically was just like a haha. You wasted a fucking a bomb spore because it, all it leads to is a fucking is fucking Cheetos room. It's like no, I don't fucking want to cheat at the game. I'm gonna be a fucking god. If I want to cheat, I'll just fucking ask Slippy what I'm supposed to do next. Okay.
I guess I'm supposed to get like that cannon to like fire at the boxes. N maybe, but I don't know, possibly not. go through there can't go through there Fucking cheat token room. Okay, I've, I, I feel like I've definitely, you know, gone a bit fucking mushy brain way too soon in this game. Like, <laughs> like you know, like I kind of went the wrong way at the beginning going to like the fucking the wrong place the with which wasn't the key it's like okay that's no, no no like that's not like necessarily a bad thing it's like they you know if you just explore a bit you could find that sure i was like man what the fuck am i doing here like <laughs> epi hi fox it's slippy seems like you need some help Yeah, but I can't like get to the fucking thing. Like they won't. The, there's like big fucking boxes in the way. Like, oh, maybe you can like fucking beat the shit out of some shark claw. Like, yeah, okay, that's fine. I sure would like to get to the shark claw. I'm supposed to take out the cannon? No? Okay. I was like the closest to like a new idea I had. Am I being really fucking brain dead stupid here or like... Like, am I, am I missing something? <laughs> oh, yes. No, I am missing something. Okay, fair enough. Well, I guess, I guess really it was a little bit, a little bit of column A, a little bit of column B. The, uh, the switch that appears once you've killed some guard. That's how switches work. It would make more sense if the door just opened, but you know, whatever. Fox McCloud, lead pilot of the Star Fox team. 
I've come to take the prince back to his home. Hey, wait! We just, we just speedboarding. No, no shooting. Just go fast. No, I don't. I, I, I don't know if I want to bump into them. Like, I mean, it's not damaging me. Other than I was like, if I'm supposed to like catch up to them, like I don't know, beat them in a race. Or like what? <laughs> I definitely went over the mine then. Oh. Oh come on! I didn't touch that. Oh, what the fuck? I was in the floor. Did I fail? Y yes, yes, I did. Okay. I guess I'm supposed to like beat them then. I guess you, you can destroy them if you get very lucky and just fucking <laughs> just bump into them a bunch when they try and leave. <laughs> I mean, one of them dead, so they can't both block me off this time. I don't know if the game would have cared about that. Yo, I'm gonna go around the right time this time. Cool. Let's just go through the floor there. Now look, they're not dead for some reason. think he'll be doing any bashing he's been captured that's why i've been sent to rescue you he's been captured that's right it was your mother that sent me to find you is she okay she'll be just fine but we need to get you home all right come on then you little shit Yo. What's that fucking popping? <laughs> Is he just not following me? Mm, tasty. 
Okay. These blue grub tub fungus. Another walker's favorite food. Problem is, they're too hard for me to catch. Try stunning them with your staff. You're really hungry. I mean, they're fucking sleeping at the moment. So, like, if you, if you couldn't, then, man, you suck. I gotta give you the fucking stay command as well. Stay. Stay. Hey, Chrono Monarch. <laughs> How are you doing? Should we be making music instead of playing video games? I mean, I'm doing a bit of music stuff earlier. I didn't even see what that did. This <laughs> is like, yeah, I sure went in there and did a thing. Oh. Okay. Oh. It didn't even do what it did. Oh well. One of your favorite games of all time. Okay. I hope I hope I play it satisfactory then. Find a secret. You can do that here as well. Fine. <laughs> Not quite the same as when he was digging in the little patch. He's just fucking scooting through the wall. Oh no, he seems to still be. Did he go? I was like, okay, I, he's like, like, yeah, I imagine he ran off because like the enemies, but like, and he run off too. <laughs> oh, there he is. Okay, you following? Yeah. So he's more just sort of running off ahead himself now. So it's just like, is this? I think this is something maybe he does if he's hungry. He just goes, no, nope, lol, I'm just gonna not be with you. <laughs> I'm giving some more mushrooms in a second. Too hungry to talk to strangers. Strangers. Did you like? No. Okay. I guess I, guess I gotta find like whatever your specific food is then as well. Oh, you just like being fucking chased by fucking shark clown. I'm just yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, ooh, mushrooms. Tricky, are you crazy? Just leave the sharp claws to me. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Hey, Fox, 
If ever you need me to come back, you just use my heal command, and I'll be right with you, okay? I was expecting that, like, oh, that's gonna, like, fly me up. But no. Have some mushrooms. I'm stuck. I'm too hungry to talk to strangers. Ooh, I can't relight the fire. No, I didn't. I didn't want to like equip the fucking uh, mushroom command. Can find the secret. Yeah. Okay, got a lot of food for myself. Not not quite any food for the uh, for that that guy, the mammoth. Fine. I <laughs> wasn't expecting that to be a little hole, but sure. Sap energy meter increases the maximum amount of magic gems that you're able to carry. And so they're underground hiding play it cool. Uh, that's a good question, Tricky. I do not know. <laughs> my, my immediate guess is... Well, okay, no, my immediate guess was going to be behind that mammoth, but there isn't even anything behind the mammoth, so... My next guess is not behind that mammoth. <laughs> we dug here. You found an alpine root. No horn loves to eat these tasty roots. The problem is they can't dig them out themselves. Well then they should have evolved better. Scarabs, you'll be able to buy many useful items. We're just gonna pull some weird faces at each other during the cutscene. Oh, cool. I can hold 50 scarabs now. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Ah, 
Wow. Very rude. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, oh, come on, dude. Peace. <laughs> I don't think they want us to go back up here. Uh, no, I'm, maybe I'm just being... There's one who's shooting at me. Man, that's such a good question, Tricky. I wish I knew. Wait, okay, okay, no, 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 hang on. Can I, like, plug this up somehow? get that like ice cube that's up there down um which i know how i do that though Wake up, I want to talk. God damn it. I actually have to wait for like the day night cycle just to like talk to that guy again. Throwing like a little explanation mark at me. Just and I was like, oh, all yeah, right, what, what, what were you trying to say? And now he's not. Now he's not trying to say anything. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think. I definitely wouldn't want us to like backtrack. Man, I'm being like really fucking bad at this game. <laughs> like, I didn't think that would be possible. I didn't think that was, that was something, you know, on my like bingo card and. Screaming. Lost him. I'm stuck. Can you? Okay, thank you. I guess I was just supposed to know that I could bring him another route and I think it's just gonna be another wallet upgrade. No, okay. Uh, yeah, those things were definitely related. Why wouldn't you do that first and then like the wallet upgrade would be like, you know, the reward for finding another one. I don't know, whatever. Just 
This block can be pushed, pulled, and moved sideways. Yes. Did it. It's fucking tricky even gonna be able to get up here. <laughs> oh yeah, yes. <laughs> We're not gonna see him get up here, but yes, yes, he can get up here. What looks very cool, folks. You better get out quick if you fall in. Okay, thank you, Slippy. to reach the hollow. And, you know, I, <laughs> I agree to those terms because... <laughs> God, I feel like there was another game that was like somewhat. Oh, it was fucking um, here the kangaroo. It was one of the here, here the kangaroo round two. It's like, yeah, there'd just be like these like, these guys are like, oh, these are the villains, and you beat up like senseless the like you beat them like fucking senseless all the fucking time. But if one of them like is like a little toll keeper guy, you never just go. No, I'll just beat the fuck out of you too. He goes like, oh fine, I guess I'll like take the non-violent approach for these guys. It's very weird. Is the Bafom Dad, a Bafom Dad. The magical creature whose powers can restore life. If you've collected a Bafom Dad and die, be used to restore you back to good health. And do you buy the Bafom Dad holder? You only carry one at a time. <laughs> okay. Why do they have to call it Bafom Dad? <laughs> Hey, Deco, welcome back. Okay, let me fucking pass then, dude. Come on. I, like, spared your life. Okay. Current take on this game is flying enemies are the fucking worst. And that was nice. So it's like, oh hey, here, here's like the scarab holder. Go, uh, go, go to the shop when you get back to Thorntail Hollow to buy some cool items. Oh, but here's also a fucking, uh, a fucking toll keeper, so that no lol, <laughs> you will have no money to do that. Like, okay, thanks, game. You're really cool. Going. There's something near. Oh, is there? Look at this. There's something near. What, what am I looking at, Tr Tricky? There's something near. What is there? Yo, I don't think they want you to swim over there because it's clearly not letting me do that. Okay, dude, yeah. Oh. 
¿Qué? <laughs> oh, okay. What the fuck do I want to go up there then if that changes the water current to be against me? Oh. Yeah. Oh, it's <laughs> fucking. <laughs> Oh shit, and then you come up here. Yay! That's my mom! Oh, thank god, I hope he's not with us for the rest of the game. Let's wait, guys, this, this is gonna be like the crystal opening, you know? That guy, he was like, we're not gonna see any more tricky. I never wanna see any more of these fine little fuckers. God, and I like, <laughs> like, I wouldn't say I have like a massive problem with the, with the auto lock on. It's generally fine. But why are you not auto locking on for like airborne enemies then? <laughs> Where are you from? Fucking what's his mom? Oh, she was like down here or something. Yeah, you know, it was, it was the thing I was saying earlier was like, like, like I just go up to these guys, like, I was like, oh yeah, they are the bad guys. You can just go up to them, beat the shit out of them. That's fine. Like, it's not even like trying to be like nuanced and like, oh, is it morally okay to like just go up and beat the fuck out of the bad guys or whatever? No, it's like, that's not a question that like this game is attempting to ask. But then like, oh, here's like the guy who's like, gonna let you pass for some money no i should be allowed to beat the fuck out of him i want my i want to save my money she is gonna be okay isn't she fox are you sure you finished down there the planet's not back together yet the queen needs my help fox out is there anything we can do for her we need to find white grub <laughs> have a furry porn actress. This game doesn't care about morals. Well. <laughs> it looks like she'll a lot. This game is out here actively discarding and destroying morals. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you find this so funny, Tricky. He was like, oh, dude, my fucking mom is like, maybe dying. Fuck, I don't know. And then cutscene ends. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that. No, I'm glad you're taking this well, Tricky. Yeah. Yeah, he is. Where's me? Yeah, because I was saying that because um, fucking KO the kangaroo round 2 did that as well. But there was like an enemy who was like. Oh, give me fucking money and I'll let you pass or whatever. And it's like, I'm sorry, he's like clearly the bad guy. Why aren't we just beating the shit out of him? <laughs> like, like, I get if they had some sort of like, I don't know, like, like a kind of like, third sort of like, you know, what wasn't like a dinosaur, like what wasn't a good guy, wasn't a bad guy, is just somebody like, like, I mean, fuck, even like money bags from Spyro, like, kind of makes sense in the fact, like, like, he's not, like, the villain of the game. Like, he's not necessarily, a, like, a good dude. He is a bit of a bastard. But he's not, like, you know, the villain of the games. So, like, that's why, like, you know, you, you only get to, like, beat, just beat the fuck out of him at the end of the game like <laughs> like you know like you only you only get to like beat the fuck out of him at the end of the game you don't you don't get to like just go no how about i kick your ass instead 
So it's like, well, you know, he hasn't really done anything wrong. Like, he's not like just one of like, like, it's not like if just one of the bad guys, like if like one of Ripto's minions or whatever in like two or something was saying like, well, oh, but how about I, um, you know, just let you do this for a fee. So, so it's just kind of weird when it is games where it's like, no, 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 you are clearly like a villain. You are on like the bad team, you know. <laughs> Why should I be just like, oh, well, sure, I I'll part with my money to let, I don't know, another bad guy live? I mean, that sounds like a lose-lose situation to me. <laughs> Maybe I'm thinking too much into this. <laughs> no, that's just like weird food place. What's, what's in this one? Firefly Lantern. Hip core map, no horn artifacts, the Buffon Dad holder. His ball high def display device. I feel like it's one of those things where it's like, oh yeah, I totally could get that, but like what would be the point currently <laughs> like i don't know like some of these it's like like yeah i could buy the maps now and that would be i guess useful but i'll be completely honest i didn't i, I didn't fucking listen to what even people were saying Got yourself stuck again? i thought i was just like <laughs> like not even paying attention white grub tub grub tub can only be found deep underground you need to find six we should to check out that huge stone well that you arrived that you walked past when you first arrived from Snowhorn Lake. Okay. Apparently, I'm digging for stuff. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna like try and pay more attention to the game, because I'm just like, like whenever, whenever fucking characters are just like talking, I just fucking zone out. <laughs> So they could make us hate Slippy more, and then they gave him this voice. Uh, one secret. That's just a perform dad. That ain't anything special. Yo, the fire weed tree. Yo, that's some some fire weed. Boy. I don't fucking remember the thing that they suggested I check out. You can hit it with a normal attack. Oh no, okay. They, 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 they were like, oh, check out like this area. I don't know how Tricky's gonna climb up this tree, but I imagine he'll find a way through the magic of miracles. Or maybe he genuinely won't. No. <laughs> no. I'm not doing it! Well, you're fucking over here now! What do you mean you're not doing it? Oh, do they mean this area? I gotta get like another power for that then I think. Why am I getting these mushrooms? I can't even use them at the moment. But 
Yeah, he's like, he's like exclamation marking me. I'm going through the fucking slippy. Yeah, I was thinking, like, is it because I'm like mid roll? And I was like, no, no, they genuinely like, like, won't, won't let me fucking. Well, slippy, you can tell me the exact same fucking thing. It's like, oh, go, I don't know, do the fucking thing or whatever. It's like, bitch, I don't even fucking know what the thing was. I wasn't paying attention, and now I'm fucking gonna be stuck. <laughs> I'm looking for like, I don't know, white mushrooms. I guess. And they're like, oh, they'll be underground. Okay. I don't know if I can only like to yeah I can't talk to these guys hey fox it's slippy seems like Come seems back. like you need to shut the fox. fuck up slippy downloading keep going Is like this the thing that they were recommending? What are they saying? Hi, Fox. It's Slippy. It's tricky Seems to check like out the huge help. stone wall that you walked past when you first arrived from Snow Hollow. Okay. okay, so I'm guessing he means this. Oh, ah. He's been blinding, that's why. Fine. Okay, where are you? Thank you. Do we have a gun? We do not. No. I mean, we, we've got like the okay, fucking, tricky. the fire blast from the, 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 the uh, help my mom. And what's it called, from the, with, with the staff. Okay, Fox, but hurry up. My mom but look, it's specific really when like Fox first lands on this planet, it's like, hey, fucking, uh, what, what's his name, General Pepper, why can't I have my blaster? And it's like, oh, you fucking idiot. Oh, we fucking shoot it. <laughs> I don't know why General Pepper's like a fucking old fucking Italian. Oh, I always fucking shoot in with you. We need to learn some respect, Fox. <laughs> you can't use your blaster till you had your gabagool. <laughs> I know. It, it, it's like, oh, this is this is like a peaceful mission. And I was like, oh, I don't fucking know. Let's go whack shit with a fucking stick then. What the fuck am I doing down here? Oh, there's a thing. There we go. Man, I better get a fucking power up in here, cause the. Uh... Otherwise, I don't fucking know what I'm doing. <laughs> we have to be careful, folks. We don't want to upset General Scales. He has nuclear weapons. I think it's the funny thing is, like, the stick wasn't even like provided. Like, we just found the stick. We just found the staff, and it so happened to be like. I guess crystal staff. I I don't know. Like, is she in the staff? Or is she was it her staff? I, I I don't really fucking know. When when we picked it up, she fucking Mario teaching teaches typing fucking floating headed at us. Um.
the fuck am I doing down there then? It definitely looked like there was a thing over there. Hmm. Yeah, so I mean, if it wasn't for like, you know, just I guess... Coincidence, <laughs> then like the staff wouldn't even be there, you know. Then we, w we just wouldn't even have a weapon. And we'd be in fucking tough shit. Especially considering so many things can be done using the staff. No, fucking fall down. Like, there's clearly something like down there. Oh, mm. okay, fine, Fox. I shall do whatever it is you wish me to do the proper way. After you know, I don't know, figuring it out because I'm a fucking dumb dumb. like a thing maybe I need to like blast or something I mean, they don't give you a lot of them they give you like a tiny bit of magic here so I'm assuming like there is potentially something I don't fucking know hey dude do you want to like come and talk to me or some shit I don't know Maybe I got like can I like all these good things. No. Yeah. Oh, I was like, I was like, what the what the fuck is this? It's like, oh, this is like the fucking yeah. Um. I feel like it wants me to have, like, the, what's it called? It's like, oh, you should have, like, the fucking, um, oh, no, there's just the, what? Mm. Okay. Yeah, there's, like, a, part of me thinks, like, oh, it's, it's, like, expecting me to have, like, the staff upgrade that, like, I don't know, I think it's basically, like, a jump or something, I don't fucking know. Like, I, I, I feel like it's expecting me to have that. I don't. <laughs> hey, what's Slippy got to say about it? Slippy here? Got yourself stuck again? Yeah, Slippy, I'm a fucking dumbass. I fucking suck at this game, apparently. Need to find something to reach those high ledges. Maybe there's, some ma maybe there's a magic cave hidden in the underground caverns. Remember, the staff will tell you when a cave is nearby. Oh, fucking will it? <laughs> It tells me when those are nearby. Oh, hang on. Uh, I, mm. There isn't really anything for like a bomb spot plan. I don't know when you stay be. Oh, that's fucking great game. Thank you a lot. Yeah. Yeah, well, we'll put the fucking bomb spore plant here and then we'll make it so that they can fucking land on the fucking wall so you can't collect them. That's good. Oh, ah ha 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 ha. Man, I'm almost dead. I'm gonna get to use my first perform dad. Oh yeah. This is a staff rocket boost. Look out for special boost pads on the ground. They usually give your staff extra rocket power. If you're off the ground onto ledges above. Yeah. Good job, Fox.
So I guess I gotta like bring Tricky down here or something then. Also not dying with the fucking one health I have. Oh no! <laughs> Do you wish to use Buffon Dad? Yes. Yes, I'll use Buffon Dad. Not a Buffon Dad. Buffon Dad. Singular. Not even, well, no, not even like a Buffon Dad singular, but like, yeah. But Buffon Dad, like, the guy. <laughs> Pushing around fucking HD texture Minecraft block. <laughs> this is what it looks like when you install texture packs on Minecraft. What's up, dude? Oops, sorry. Fifty years alone I've been thinking of entering the Lord Sanctum without a lantern to light your way. You must be as mad as me! Go and see the shopkeeper. He should be able to help at the right price. <laughs> ah, I want to hit you again. <laughs> Dinosaur sounded from Banjo Tui. I haven't played Banjo 2, that, that's... Probably not close on my list now, but yeah, I, I gotta get around to Banjo 2 at some point. So hang on, what, what... Was there like even a thing? Down there? <laughs> no, I I haven't I haven't played Banjo Tui yet. I've had it for quite a while now. I got it quite a few years ago. Um, <laughs> Banjo Tui Grundy's Revenge. Oh, that's a different one. That's like two of them. <laughs> I played Grundy's Revenge. It was mm, I didn't think much of it, but. I'd say there's a decent chance I'll probably end up checking it out this year. Yeah, yeah, that was the GBA one I played last year. It was uh, Grunty's Revenge. I, I like, yeah, I didn't think much of it. The first half I thought was decent, and then it just gets a bit shit. <laughs> like, I really think it falls apart in like the later areas of the game. <laughs> Don't judge Tui by the GBA one. I, I'm, I'm not gonna, yeah. I like... Yeah, I, I mean, I know Tui is probably gonna be more similar to Kazooie than... Uh, than Grunty's Revenge. I mean, what? I think Grunty's, Grunty's Revenge, I think, was made after Tui. But was set in between Kazooie and Tui. I, I I think I refer I refer to it as a mid call because it's in, you know it, it, it's both a prequel and a sequel. <laughs> oh, sick miss, dude! No one. There it is. There we go. But yeah, I mean, I checked out, I played, uh, I streamed Banjo-Kazooie in 2020. I did, I did Grunty's Revenge last year. 
So I don't, but I'd, I'd like to get to um, three this year. I mean, the one, the, the one, the one that's going to be difficult for me is getting around to nuts and bolts. Because I would like to play nuts and bolts at some point. I genuinely would. I like, I, I, I'm very interested in how that game handles, considering I've never played it. Oh, it's nice that that Bafonda is still there. Um, but, but I don't, I don't have an Xbox. I don't have like anything Xbox. As I don't know, like, I, I don't think it's on PC, even though they're kind of doing, like, sometimes it feels like Microsoft does things where it's like, oh, yeah, we're going to, like, kind of make our, like, Xbox games on um, PC now as well. But I don't think they're doing that for, like, their older games. No, that's too low. Okay, dude. No, that's too low. Okay. You know, okay, so it was like, oh. Gotta have fireflies. Sure, like, what, what do I even need the fireflies? <laughs> like, Flippy, Flippy, where the fuck am I going? Hope that helps you, Fox. Hi, Fox. It's Don't forget, you may need to use. <laughs> Dude, that's a typical cheap ass Brit right here. Oh, no. if, if the game has a bartering system, I expect to be able to barter a little bit. Come on. <laughs> but every time I've tried to barter an item, it's like, no, pay your fucking price, I put it out. Like, you think at this point, he, he, he just shouldn't have mentioned that, like, you know, that we, we could haggle for it. No, come back. We need that. Oh, you meant the dinosaur, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I guess he's British, yeah. I guess everyone, well, I don't know about everybody. A lot of characters in this game will be British because, because it's a game by Rare. The so what? The, the fucking big, the, the fucking stone, the warp stone guy, he was Scottish. There was some mammoth earlier, so I was like, I. I couldn't quite place their accent. Like, I don't think it was Scottish. It might have been an attempt, att an attempt at a Welsh accent, if I'm being completely honest. But it also could have just... It very I was like, It could have been a Welsh accent, but it also could have been just somewhere north, which is, like, not near Wales at all. Hmm. <laughs> No, 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 no. The, the dinosaurs are just like the dinosaurs, I guess. Right, so I've got my fucking firefly lantern, crazy guy. Ah, a lantern to light your way. Good. Yes, very good. Good, good, excellent. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, uh, that's like, I guess like a little bit of British in like that guy's voice. Okay, can I like, how, how, how do you get down here though? Oh, no, this is, um, yeah, this is, this is one of these. This is, oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hooray, we got a white grub tub.
for do I like okay now I was like do I need to put these in like a fucking in my jar or something or this is a firefly it'll be stored inside the firefly lantern I have bad news. I'm moving out of this, regaining my own place in a real job, which means I won't be by much anymore. Aww. Well, congratulations on getting your own place and a real job. But <laughs> commiserations on not being able to enjoy this quality entertainment anymore. <laughs> I guess I have to like be able to see where Oh fuck, I don't, I don't... I don't have any more things. Maybe you can have earbuds in and work and listen, but you don't know the feel of the jobs like yet. Hmm. <laughs> oh, okay. You're going to be working on the construction site. Okay. Oh, hey, I hope that goes well. I, you know, I wish you luck with it all. Thank you. Something tells me I'm not intended to jump down there. <laughs> it feels like Corona's finally ending, yeah. <laughs> I gotta get some some more fun things for us. forever to land <laughs> why do they have to be so slow that there I didn't, <laughs> didn't need to use it quite yet something I'm curious about um what time is it over there you're in Canada aren't you Decker what time is it currently for you because I'm, ne I'm never really sure what time like I I'm like my streams are in other places like I, I mean I can vaguely guess that Europe like the rest of Europe is like an hour ahead I'm never actually like really sure like for America I'm like North America Oh, 
3 p.m. Okay. In about two and a half hours. Yeah, so I, I, I guess like I'm a bit of an afternoon streamer for you guys. Which, which is interesting because I'm a, I'm sort of an evening late streamer for, for Europe. Oh, for fuck's sake. None of these are going to float down here, are they? Oh, no, they are. There you go. I actually didn't need to go all the way back up, but okay. Oh well. Well, that's uh, six, isn't it? It is. Now we can go back to Tricky's mother and save her, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, that's the thing. I'm, I think about like when I used to. Um, I think when I used to. No, we used to. When I like first went uh, casual, I, like, I don't really like. I never really had like a set time I would stream when I was speed running. I think I always used like would have like a time that I like to start a stream by. Usually, depending on like the game. But I, w I wouldn't really be able to tell you like what times. I'd like to start things that back then. But I think like when I started, um, when I like started casual streaming, started like having like a consistent schedule. I'm sure I used to start streams at like nine, sort of half nine, half nine UK time, which like for reference, like it's 10 o'clock now. And like, I'd still stream for like four hours or so. In a way, I think it was a sort of like, you know, attempt to like defuck up my sleep schedule a little bit. So like, stream earlier, you know, stream earlier so that like, you know, when I finish the stream, <laughs> like I, I'll go to bed and then it will be a reasonable time. And then at the moment it's just like, oh yeah, well, I still like, I still like fall asleep at like 3 a.m. <laughs> I just don't necessarily want to be streaming until then. <laughs> Unless we do, uh, you know, unless we do a tulip finale, in which case, what? I, I think that one went till 4 a.m. That stream. <laughs> what are you playing at? Mom needs the mushroom. Now say grub tubs. Say grub tubs, voice actor. Thank you, Fox. Thank you for saving my son and for saving me. Okay, okay, enough of the thanks. Now I need some help from you. Can you just tell me what's going on? This is all the work of General Scales. General he is the ruler Scales. of the Sharp Core tribe. A nasty bunch of pirates who have always <laughs> wanted to rule Dinosaur Planet. We have always been able to stop his attacks. But this time he somehow become stronger and defeated our army at the Krizoa Palace. Right, a bad guy. But how did the planet get in such a mess? Within the Krizoa Palace, he broke the seals of the Force Point Temples. I'm listening. This planet is rich with a magical force. I got, I got, I got, I got to so be listening too. This is she's gonna say, she's gonna say like, oh, go over here, do this, and I'm gonna be like, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Okay. and I'm gonna be like, uh, Slippy, what the Weird, fuck did she say? I understand. With the seals broken, Scales entered the temples <laughs> and removed the spell stones. With nothing to hold back the magic force, the planet was torn apart. At last, it all makes sense. So, the bad guy takes the spell stones, your planet falls apart, and I've got to find the spell stones and bring them back to the Force Point temples. See, Mom, I told you he was good. Star Fox, yeah. <laughs> My Star Fox, son yeah. will remain with you. Fucking no, he won't. Fuck off. Noble birth can breathe life into the spell stones. What? Uh, that's okay, but don't you think he's a bit young? Uh, I mean, it's gonna be very dangerous. Loads of bad guys fighting, death. He knows the planet well, and I'm sure he's shown you his sidekick skills. Oh yeah, I forgot about those. 
Come on, Fox. We'll make a great team. Okay, but if you mess up just once, I'll send you straight back to Mommy. Okay, yeah, yeah. Good. Now, our spies have indicated that Scales was last seen in Dark Ice Mines. I know the gatekeeper, Garunda Tay. A silly fellow, but he can guide you to the spellstone. <laughs> a silly fellow. Oh, okay, I, I wanna. Got it. I wanna know what and a silly Fox, fellow. I think you'll need in this. this world is. The shark claws dropped it when they attacked me. Maybe it'll come <laughs> in use somewhere. Okay, <laughs> She's just open. He can gets just get killed. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh yeah, uh, only someone of noble birth can, I don't know, uh, do the thing. So, bye bye, son. Fucking go play with Fox a bit more. Yeah, Star Fox, yeah! <laughs> oh, thank fuck. <laughs> Didn't think that would work, but. <laughs> I guess raising a fucking idiot son has some benefits. Right, so we gotta go to that place I think that I went to earlier and it was like, hey, I can't do anything over here. So, uh, you know what I can do though? You know what, you know what I should do? I'll buy a map for that area. So I can be like, hey, I know where I'm going. And then, you know, someone will say something and I won't fucking know where I'm going. <laughs> What was it? It's like fucking moon ice, moon mountain pass. Scanners indicate that this is your current position. Scanners indicate that. Scanners indicate. Fox, I have been studying your mission. Wait. Read the information. Scanners indicate that this is your. Scanners indicate. Okay, no, I guess I guess I'm not going there. I'm going to Snowhorn Waste. Fuck it, I'll buy the map for there as well then. I guess not, maybe not as well, but just there in general. In general, scales! Ha ha! Pass like the village, but that that was like where we were actually going, wasn't it? Dark Ice Mines. Slippy here, got yourself stuck again. Come back when you need Fucking... me. Slip. Hi, Fox. Scanners indicate that this <laughs> like... is your current position. I, I, you know, what? I, I won't even say like, oh man, I'm like really fucking annoyed by like Slippy's Fuck. voice, but just the fucking, hey, the fuck, fucking stuck again, like the little dumb fucking bitch you are. <laughs> it's like God, it's it's like it's the it's the voice of the combat, like the combination of his voice and what he says. It's like, oh god damn, I, you know. Like, I already feel like a fucking dumbass for checking the fucking what to do next button. And then fucking Slippy's already like, hey, fucking dumbass! <laughs> okay, oh, Pog, I got a discount. That's the big Pog champs. I fucking hounded him enough. I finally got that one scarab off. Happy here. I'll display Fox. I have been studying your mission. Read the information on screen. Check the detail readout, Fox. I think it might help. Scanner. I hope my. Yep. Okay. Whatever, dude.
I mean, I, I expected that to be like, um, what was it like fucking Wind Waker, Legend of Zelda Wind Waker? Well, like if you break like the pots and like the place that gets the guy's house that gets used for the auction house at night, he fucking like you're gonna pay for this, and like takes all your money as like compensation, and then he chucks you out. Those like weird fucking green things. Oh, those are like my fireflies, I think. So, it's all right. I'm going to fucking. General Pepper here. That's not where I'm going, but whatever. Yo, seventy percent through the game. Fox, I haven't got time to wait around for you. Let's fucking shut the fuck up. I'm like checking shit and he's like, Fox, get the fuck back to work, you lazy fucker. Like, dude, come on. I'm checking my fucking stats. Chill, bro. Like that, so impatient. Like, can he like walk me or is he just going to be like, no lol? Oh man, who knows? I, I I guess we don't want to go to Ice Mountain. Fuck it, we'll go to the game may as well, or the game well maze, whatever the fuck it was called. Cause I don't know what this is. It has game in the title, it's gonna be good. Well, it is in fact a maze. Ow. <laughs> I did it. I think. I don't really know. <laughs> okay, no, I don't think I did it. <laughs> fucking sent. Wow, what a maze. It sent, sent me back to where I came from. Cool. <laughs> I was like, oh, are you, are you sure you didn't just like get turned around? No, no, I'm pretty sure. Right, so, okay, the fucking map won't tell me like where to go. Fireweed tree. So yeah, so like we, we got a key and I was like, okay, well there was like a key thing for um like we went earlier, which was like Moon Mountain Path. I don't think the game wants us to like the game seems to suggest no 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 go to fucking uh Snowhorn Wastes. Go go talk to someone in Snowhorn Wastes. Not fucking talking to you, Peppa. Hi, Fox. Fox, I have been studying your mission. Read the information on screen. Uh, yeah, I guess we're going there then. Check the detail readout, Fox. Stay. Uh. 
something interesting that hasn't like isn't really like a big deal at the moment but depending on like how much they feel like how many different like abilities and shit they feel like introducing i can see kind of becoming a bit annoying and one thing i find interesting is like just to like i i guess it probably wouldn't have been like the same team but so well like, the same like part of rare was so the one like thing that rare did with um with conquer and conquered bad fur day was a lot of the game was like a lot of like inputs and things that happened in the game were all done uh, context sensitive context sensitive to context which basically meant like they basically just had it so like the b button essentially did everything but it would do different things depending on the scenario that you were in so I mean, sometimes you'd be you know so there'd be like a big fucking b button and you'd be like oh press the fucking b button to do some wacky thing and the reason why i'm bringing this up is because obviously at the moment like the staff is like oh you've got the fire blast and you got the staff booster now that's not a big deal at the moment that's not like oh shit i'm fucking overwhelmed but like the staff booster well you can only use that at specific spots so to me i'm like well, that doesn't need to be like you know like it, it's like a little command thing that does like to me that's like that doesn't need to be on like here that can just be like a you go up to the thing and you press the b button or you press the a button you know so it's very weird to me that I'll, you know a game like conquer can kind of not really take advantage but like you know make the best out of having kind of the limited buttons that the n64 controller have has had whatever um claw have imprisoned me in this or it's kind of <laughs> i don't know star fox dimension kind of feels a bit weird with it i'll be strong enough to get myself out perhaps the young prince sorry what help. were you saying i was talking about hurry boy Bonker. There you go, I'm gonna beat these guys up. Oh, I've got like, I don't know, not let him die, I guess. Ow. <laughs> it like took me out of the fucking uh, thing for a second. I was like, nope, no lock on for you. I didn't like I don't know <laughs> like that like one line of dialogue that like I wasn't paying attention because I was talking about fucking Conquered Bad Fur Day I hope that wasn't like a really important line like I feel like it was and it's just like oh these enemies are just gonna like spawn infinitely until you like do a thing like, what, 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 what weird little combo am I doing there
Wiggly, pet is slippy. What do I do? Hey, Fox, it's slippy. Seems like you need some help. It had the frost weed to the gatekeeper's trunk. Come back. Yeah, it was like. <laughs> Yeah, I like missed like one fucking line of dialogue and I'm fucking completely clueless. God damn, why does this keep fucking happening? Man, that's some sick fucking aim. <laughs> I'm glad they made the fucking enemy so small that you can't actually. The fucking auto aim misses. That's good. Did you did you do the find? Hey, so you got you got distracted by by me. No, it's just the fucking perform that. I don't give a fuck about perform that. No, I don't want a fucking cheat token. Why do they keep throwing these at me? Hey, go on, take the cheat token. Like, I, I don't need a cheat token. I keep fucking checking Slippy for advice. I basically already am using the cheat token. Fuck's a frost weed. If you can bring me three frost weeds, I'll be strong enough to get myself out. Okay, but like again, what? What is this? A, is this like a frost weed tree? I guess it is. Ah, uh, okay. Never fucking mind. That I didn't even know what a fucking frost weed was. Is supposed to fucking know apparently. I guess. I don't know. I guess if you have like the scan thing. Yeah, I, th I, th I think that's what I'm learning is that like having the fucking like. I don't know. The, the scanner up is way more useful than like the map. <laughs> Hey, I got it. How's it going? Oh, 
the soldiers spawning infinitely. I know you have second place in glitches. I did not. Suken. Ow. Stop, stop, stop. No, oh, come on, dude. You could have, like, fucked it up then. Uh, fucking. Where did this go? God damn it. <laughs> what are the strat? I'm a current strat. It's just trying to ignore them, I guess. So I, th I, th I think you, you can use tricky, I think. Uh, someone said use tricky. Oh, for fuck's sake. And then he just sort of takes it to them, okay. McLeod. My mother sent us to find you. Well, I am Garunda Tay, Spellstone Gatekeeper of Dark Eyes Mine. We're looking for a spellstone. A spellstone? Hmm. It is my duty as a gatekeeper to guard the land from which a spellstone is forged. General Scales took the spellstone and discovered that I was a gatekeeper. He gave me an ultimatum. Allow him to take the spellstone back into the sacred land, or he would destroy my tribe. I could not risk the safety of the entire planet, so I refused to help. My daughter did not think this way, and so to save the tribe, she opened the gateway herself. Scales did not destroy my tribe. He enslaved them instead. <laughs> oh, oof. My daughter dishonored me. Are what a stupid the idiot. Within dark ice mines and return it to the volcano fourth point temple. Only then will the spellstone's power be returned. I will open the gateway. Hooray. Hey Fox, check out Peppy's Dinosaur Planet map to see where to head next, because apparently it's not going to be clear. We're all back. Fox, I have been studying your... Scanners indicate that this is your current position. The flashing dots... <laughs> the funnier and the more I kind of understand. <laughs> Oh I mean, yeah, I like I I, I get I get him. It's just, his daughter being like, no, no, save the tribe, not the world. Keep going, Fox. You're doing good. So can I just like I don't know, leave here? This is my first playthrough. Yeah, yeah. I like played it like a bit as a kid, but I will not have any of that knowledge. <laughs> like any knowledge from when I played it as a kid will have not been retained. <laughs> Stay. 
Yeah, I mean, it's, it's interesting, like, you know, there seems to be, like, a decent number of people who seem to still like this game, you know? Like, despite its kind of, I guess, despite its reputation, you know? Well, not necessarily despite its reputation, but, you know. <laughs> what a reputation um well i i, I don't know I, I think it's more like be, be, because it's like not really like you know it's very different to the rest of the star fox theories it's kind of like seen of like seen as like a bit of the black sheep of the series I think it's sort of that difference between like like people who grew up with like Star Fox 1 and Star Fox 64 kind of like looking back on this and going oh yeah it was like completely different and not what we wanted in like a new Star Fox game or whatever and like people who grew up with this and not really like the other Star Fox games have been like no this was fine or whatever did I buy the Befarm Dad folder? I didn't this game is like, yeah, it, it, it's very, it, 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 it's quite Zelda -y. Okay, I'll <laughs> you. Yeah, the, the, there's the whole thing that it started off as, um, you know, as, as Dinosaur Planet. And then became, um, became Star Fox. What does this even do? The height? You pay this much. I don't even know what this is, but like, I'm like... No, fuck it. That's too low. Let's buy it anyway. Okay, I'll sell it to you. <laughs> this is Fox's high-def display device. And Slippy airdropped it to you, but the shopkeeper got it first. That's why you've had to buy it. <laughs> that shopkeeper never misses a chance to get scoured. Press Z to bring up the display and use C to zoom in and out. Oh. That was just the fucking first person mode. Except lol, you had to buy it. <laughs> okay. He did tell you you could buy for 17, that'll help you with the speedrun. <laughs> so big. Hi, Fox. Oh, is it about to like... Check the detail readout, Fox. I think it might help you. Yeah, that actually didn't, <laughs> my dude. <laughs> the beacons seem to burn brighter now that the queen is well. Oh. The uh, beacons burn brighter, do they? Mine's clogs in the sky above. Yeah, okay, no, that's what I was like, I'm sure you gotta like take the fucking like this shit. But I'm like scanners indicate that this is uh, it, it's like uh, I go here I guess. You get stuck feel free. <laughs> I mean I I have very much been abusing the fucking ask slippy. <laughs> Even if fuel cells to be dark ice mines. Yeah, okay. Oh, he made like one line of dialogue and it's like, uh, Slippy, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> She will be able to help you. Free the snow 
There we go, we get a little bit more Star Foxen. Star Foxen across the universe. Ow. I don't know what that was, but uh, yeah, I guess I wasn't allowed it. I wasn't sure. I, th I think maybe I like tried to, but I did like a second late or something. Okay, I, th I think I only noticed it was like a different thing at the last second. <laughs> no map data. Find a way into the mine, but beware the golden. Ah, oh, I totally know what a golden is. Can you help me get free? Sure. You seem to know why I'm already here. Oh, get the spell stone and save our child. They are. <laughs> what? Oh, what a what a coinky dink. That's exactly what I'm here to do. You know when you, you know you, when you're already gonna do something and then somebody tells you to do it and you're like, wow, well, now I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> specific
It's not like a thing you can interact with, is it, Tricky? Doesn't seem to be. Oh my god. <laughs> I think these things just keep respawning. Oh, hang on, hang on, wait. The fucking food, child. I'm stuck. Fine. <laughs> fine. <laughs> I thought that was tricky. Saying like, oh, fine. It's Fox saying fine. <laughs> things I find kind of interesting about playing through this game is like I don't know it, like it's obviously not really a, a, as popular as like various Zeldas or like some other games so it's like I don't know it, it's one that like I've never really watched anyone play like like obviously I'm, I'm sure there are people playing it and streaming I mean well I'm streaming it but you know like over the years, like none of the people, like none of the very streamers I, I watch or anything, I haven't seen anyone play Star Fox Adventure. So it's like, it's, it's not almost like, oh, I know like little bits about it just from like, like, you know, like when, like when I was playing through Tulip, like there were various bits that I'd remembered just because I had played, um, or just because I had watched someone play it a few years ago. Yeah. I mean, I, I I guess admittedly, like I don't really watch like all that many streamers. Thank you for releasing me. If you're but... heading down into the mine, then please look out for Belina Tay, the gatekeeper's daughter. She didn't mean to get us into this mess by telling Scales about the spellstone. She did what she thought was right. Please help her. Okay, lady. I'll keep a lookout for her. This might be of use to you. I found it while I was working. It looked important, so I mm. hid it from the Yeah, I mean, I, like, I'm sure there are, like, people playing. I, it's probably more down to, like, me not watching that many streamers. Like, <laughs> really? So, like, the, you know, the few streamers I do watch just haven't, like, played this or anything. Or, like, you know, or at least haven't, maybe, like, haven't streamed it. Or at least while I've been watching them anyway. Um, so yeah, so for me, it just doesn't have that sort of like, you know, like I like I haven't really like learned much about the game through like, through sort of like osmosis, you know, I haven't, I've been like, oh, I know, you know, I know like about this thing or that thing or whatever. Like, I feel like the closest really it gets is, um the the nitro rad video on it like i i probably know like a couple of things about this game from that but would that just be more like you know just just a, a video and not like a stream it obviously you know, it, it's not exactly like a play-by-play -play of the game yeah I, I i imagine i imagine people from the zelda community probably well, I, I don't know whether they like the game. I guess it you know, very, very per streamer, but <laughs> you'd get why the Zelda community would take an interest in this one. <laughs> I think it's also just because of being a, you know, just because of it being a Nintendo game, you know. I mean, you know, there, there, there's a lot of crossover with like. That sort of thing, you know. You know, like, like if like a new Star Fox were to come out, I'm sure like a lot of the people you see currently streaming the new Kirby would probably there'd be a decent chance and a high crossover that 
um, you know, that they'd play like a new Star Fox that would come out. I am forever in your debt. I see your little friend has yet to learn his flame command. What do you mean, flame command? Go on, youngster. Give it a go. Wow, it's that easy. If I wasn't so exhausted, I could help you through the main gates. I need some food. Um, food. He said that kind of weird, I think. <laughs> food. I just say I hate these little guys. All the little fellas popping out of the ground. Don't like them. <laughs> I'm sure this was ice, Jess. I guess it's this one. Sounds like I'm, I'm sure there was just some ice here. Flame. Ow. I don't know if I'm supposed to bring that block down here, it doesn't look like it. Like, well, clearly, this block has got to be down here for something. It's maybe to get back up. Yeah, I guess so. Not really what I intended to do, but sure. Well, well done, Tricky. You kind, you kind of help. Oh, okay, all that did was get us magic energy. Right. No, you can't even like roll jump. Come on. I got a buff on, Dad. I feel like I might die soon. 
<laughs> Is that like where, where can I tell? Okay, yeah. I've got a single before I'm dead. Oh, that's better. But I need more. I don't know where you want that extra one from then. I don't know if there's gonna be anything up here. Not, not entirely sure what that's intended to be, but okay. for either. Sorry, sorry, Tricky, I meant to feed you, but oh, I'll, I'll give you a little whack on the head as well. So it's like a little, I don't know, call the mammoth platform. Shit, Tricky's gonna get cannoned. M maybe. I don't know, he's, he's like got a cannon and he's just like, no, I won't do anything with it actually. Wait up, Fox. Dude, I'm going so fucking slow. What do you mean, wait up? Get off this guy. And tell me I gotta like go all the way back. Oh wait, no, 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 this one there. I 
There's all ice things somewhere I saw. Where was that? That's for when I'm done with whatever this is. I was like, oh, you gotta kill like this many enemies. And I was like, okay, well, I, I'm pretty sure I did that. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, I didn't go up here because I thought it was like, oh, this is like another fucking mammoth platform. Oh, I, like, I don't really need to use one of them. Or oh, I don't need to use that yet. I guess I gotta like, kill these guys specifically. Can I at least use their cannon? Yes, I can. You're in control of a sharp core cannon. Use stick to aim aid to fire longer than your name to press you shoot. So you use power from your staff energy meter. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> that definitely looks like a thing I'm supposed to hit. It's either not... No, 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 it is. You couldn't decide how precise it wanted me to be with it. killed one guy from that they were like both just stuck at the door <laughs> really should have got the double kill on that i can't tell if i got both of, if i've like hit enough things for the door i'm gonna go go i assume so but i don't know I think I gotta get one more, maybe. Okay, everybody come back out so I can bomb you some more.
There we go. <laughs> this is the one more I needed. <laughs> This better be good because I, I think this is actually just an op. Oh no, okay, it wasn't an optional thing. Oh, like, this better be fucking worth it because this, this, this looked like it was end, ended up being optional. No, no, it's it's like extra worth it because it's required. <laughs> Like a fucking rubber chicken or something. Flame. Well, it's a good thing we got this stuff, considering how much of how, how, how much of this planet is like required. It has it required to get around? How the fuck do these dinosaurs and shit get around? They can't use this fucking staff. Yeah, how do these guys get around the fucking planet? I'm not sure they do. Nope. Don't think I want to go up there. No. <laughs> No, I'm, I didn't mean to go back up there again. It's gonna matter which order I put these in. I'm gonna say. N hmm. I'm not entirely sure if I'm gonna say no. Oh, it looks. <laughs> you curious to how I'll solve the next part? Oh god. <laughs> Then the leap of faith lies an ancient prize. Okay. I, I sure would like to get up there though. Hmm. 
No, I didn't want that. them away for some reason. Hmm. It like locks these up. Part of me that's not entirely sure if I have everything that I need to solve whatever's going on in this room. Flame. Oh, now, now you can flame it. Wherever the fuck he is. Where is he? He didn't flame. fucking like go in there, is he? <laughs> what? Where the fuck is he? <laughs> fucking lost him. Is he completely got like? Uh, is is he in the thing? Is he in there? in the hole. What are you doing over here, dipshit? Come on. <laughs> oh, now I'm not sure if like it, it was like actually letting me flame or if it was just confused. I need the game to not be confused, then we can <laughs> we can do it properly. You little bitch. And the fucking time is still going. God damn it! What is this fucking Kirby? I like sense if you watch my Kirby stream. I completely forgot about like the leap of faith until like I jumped. <laughs> Flame. Oh, 
I'm gonna try and remember where that horn pad was. <laughs> Which sounds, I don't know, vaguely dirty. The horn pad. <laughs> you gotta go to the horn pad, yeah. Hey, nah, dude, I, I don't, I don't want to go to the horn pad. That's some gross. Uh, where was it? Was it up here? This way, I think. Yeah. <laughs> that blow did not go in his mouth. <laughs> did Tricky die yet? But he he kind of I don't know got stuck somewhere. And like refused to help us with the puzzle, but not quite dead, no. <laughs> Sorry, dude. To guide the snowhorn through the blizzard. He will need to be fed alpine roots as you explore. Look on the ground and walk over them to eat. Okay. <laughs> You're gonna die now, yeah. Alright, so basically just follow... Follow the path of roots. for the first time in two years there's so much dust <laughs> tricky tricky no oh god Yeah, you, 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 you can breathe fire, right? <laughs> what? No! Oh, never mind then. <laughs> Ooh, you can't break the big rock. Thanks for hanging out, Hydraulics. Have a good night. Oh. Racing time. And we're just kind of going through areas we've been through.
Oh shit. I can just leave. <laughs> bye bye, tricky. Shit, I can't. <laughs> no. Ow. Okay, Fox is like resistant to fire. Oops, I need keys. Really, you can't just like go past that. Hey, dude! Stop! <laughs> it's me, the savior. Stop doing that. <laughs> Fucking yeah, thank you. Okay, no. no, it's okay, Fox. You just clearly can't go over that. It makes perfect sense. Entirely sure where they're wanting me to go for this. I think they definitely want me to rescue uh, Tricky. But I mean, man, do I not currently know where he is right now? <laughs> oh, and did Rare make this? They did. This was going to be Rare. Which is, why, which, why, which, why, which is why many of the characters sound British. <laughs> Fox. Okay, I'm guessing there isn't something there yet. Oops. Uh, 
And I clearly can't do anything with this until... Dude, you're sleeping. Stop talking. <laughs> Stop yelling for help. You're asleep. Briefly walk back onto the conveyor belt. Oh no, Jeopardy! <laughs> I'm like, no, it's 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 fine. But I'll, I'll just walk off the conveyor belt again. <laughs> I was like, oh okay, yeah, he's good. Oh, there's what? There's literally a fucking switch there. Jesus, I'm blind. I was like, nah fam, I'm gonna save the other person first. Fuck you, Tricky. Okay, now we can free the slaves, I guess. Yo, that was a sick slide, Fox. Like pointing upwards. Look, look, it's slave. Who are you? I am Fox, and this is the Crown Prince of the Earthwalkers. We've been sent by the Snowhorn Gatekeeper to find the Spellstone. Do you know where it's hidden? My name is Belina Tay. The Gatekeeper is my father. Did he send you to rescue me? I I'm sorry, Belina, but he feels you have betrayed the beliefs of the Gatekeepers. We were only sent to find the Spellstone. <laughs> the old fool. I had to save the tribe. If it wasn't for my father being a gatekeeper, none of this would have happened in the first place. You damn bitch. <laughs> Although I like, I like the base of the guy look like, oh, she opened up like a new way. Oh, and then the new way has like immediately been closed off, huh? Belina, are you there? Listen carefully. Find a way to the bottom of the mine. I'll meet you there. But it's okay, because there's going to be like a little hole here. Oh, 
Okay. I guess I can grab onto that ledge. Or that ledge. Oh. <laughs> like when you go to set out, I always think you go, oh, I'm starving. It's like, dude, just fucking fed you. Come on. It just seems like a very good uh, good way to sort of waste away a buffom dad. <laughs> oh, not a buffom dad. Buffom dad. The buffom dad. Definitely look like that was what they were expecting me to do. Otherwise, otherwise being up here doesn't really make sense. Like, I don't exactly know what, like, I'm supposed to get out from being up here. Yes, just fucking respawn that enemy. Very nice. Very good of you. Very specific ones. Good. If you just fuck these up, you just gotta live with it, apparently. Come on, hurry up. What? No! I not be allowed to do that. Fuck you. Yeah. 
I'm not fucking let him get in me again. Oh, fuck me. I can't even fucking climb back up this. Oh my god. Okay. Good. I don't even. I don't even have a perform dad anymore. Sorry, the perform dad. Oh Jesus! I'm pretty sure that fucking I took fall damage from that as well. Money. I don't need money, I need help. Fucking fantastic. I don't care. <laughs> it's just like we've already been reunited and he's all of a sudden just like, holy oh, fuck, by the way. We it's like, yeah, dude, I fucking. I guess I didn't know, but I guess I figured it out. camera angle we're trying to go for there. Fox, what the fuck are you doing? Dude, you stupid fucking creature. Okay, don't fucking know why that happened. That was very dumb and annoying. And uh, then we just respawned. Okay, okay, bye bye then. Right. Jump off all of the fucking little platform, except the one, like except the final one. God damn it! Oh, thank you, Fox. You decided to do it properly this time. Thank you. Oh. 
did I even do? Oh, I guess it like created like a little platform here. Of that money real quick. Wait, is this like the conveyor belt song or something? Like the theme for the mine and then the conveyor belt song <laughs> General Scales had hidden it somewhere close. Look what carefully. I'm sure you and your little friend can find it before they do. Time is short. You must find the spell stone. For a second, I was worried it was going to go. And yes, there is a timer now. I was like, oh, fuck, please, no. if I bought the map to this area I, 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 I was like so when, when I bought the map so I was like oh yeah because I'm going like here and then you no know, going to a completely different place <laughs> looking for just anything that looked like it would be something and there it is oh god okay. yeah wonderful it'd be like if um You know, in like sort of like N64, but more so PlayStation One, um, like that era. Um, so like play PlayStation One era, there was sort of like a weird thing of like, oh, we gotta get like these like old 
like arcade mascots. We gotta like update them and bring them into like, you know, into 3D. We gotta like 3D alize them. I mean, I'm gonna get a bit of health. For fuck's sake, why? Of course, that's full damage. And of course, that has like the range of a motherfucker. Where the fuck is it gonna throw me now? I wish to quit the game. Oh no! <laughs> oh, you died and you had no buffom, Dad. Would you like to quit like a little baby? It's like, no, no, oh, I'm alright, game, I'll live. Sorry. <laughs> no, what it reminds me of is that sort of like PlayStation 1 era where they were like trying to take old like arcade master in games and sort of like, you know, turn them into like 3D games and like 3D platforms and stuff. So, you know, they had like like Pac-Man and um, Frogger are the two that really come to mind, I guess. So there, there was like, what, fucking Breakout got one? I'm pretty sure fucking Pong got one as well. Um, you know, they was taking like these old like arcade or like old like Atari games and being like, oh yeah, we, we got like fucking... Um, this is bullshit, by the way. You know, we got 3D eyes. Like, this is, this is, makes me think of, like, if they tried to do that with Donkey Kong. You know? Like... Like, I, I don't know. I, I wouldn't say, like, they really did that with Donkey Kong. Like, obviously, they didn't really, like, 3D realize him. They were just, like, um... You know, they did that one for, like, the Game Boy. Where it was, like... It like starts off as Donkey Kong and then it goes into like its whole, it's like its complete own thing. Um, I guess that was like March of the Mini, or not March of the Minis, I don't know which one that is. But yeah. the, the, like, the, the, it, like the, whichever, like the ones with the, the Mario Minis, like Mario, Mario versus Donkey Kong is what it's that. That did a whole fucking thing of health. I had a whole fucking heart left. Jesus Christ. <sighs> yeah, this, this makes me think if they tried to like, oh, we, we got like, you know, make it like a 3D Donkey Kong game. But, you know, you, you gotta dodge the barrels in like the 3D space. Which, you know, I was gonna be like, oh man, whether or not that'd be a good thing, I don't know. And it's like, I don't know, man, if it, if it was anything actually like this, it would fucking suck balls and I would hate it. Fuck did it? Like, I'm, I'm still now baffled by how that one like took off like an entire heart. Like, like it only ever doing like a quarter, and I was like, but that, like that one just went like no inch to fucking death. <laughs> 3D Donkey Kong game went. <laughs> hey, I thought Donkey Kong 64 was fine. It's all right. <laughs> it wasn't great. It was. I wouldn't even say it was terrible. Very over ambitious. Oh yeah, I, I, you know what? I wouldn't even say it was over ambitious. Like maybe just there was too much, you know. It's a, a testament to '90s excess. That's <laughs> Donkey Kong 64. Even though I like what I'm pretty sure I ended up coming out in like 2000 or something. I'm not even sure it would have been a 90s game. And that's the thing as well, like... Like, Donkey Kong 64, like, isn't like they, um... 
isn't like they turned the original like arcade Donkey Kong into a 3D game, you know? Donkey Kong 64 is basically just a rare made a collectathon again. <laughs> you know, like, like Donkey Kong 64 is just they used, they, they made Banjo Kazooie with like five times the characters and items and things to collect. And it was a bit of a clusterfuck. What the fuck do I do with this now? <laughs> like, I've, I've brought this barrel up and now I'm like, now what? <laughs> what am I actually intended to blow up? I just wanted to drop it. I just wanted to put it down. I have to do that again now. I'm so, 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 so mad. <laughs> oh. That's definitely like a jump for make, you know, that that's not like a... I don't know, these, these ga games very... Okay, well, there's the fucking thing that I've got to blow up. How the fuck am I supposed to get uh, barrel up ladders? What's, what's the intention for that? Oh, of course, there's like a fucking magnetic thing. Oh, fucking no. <laughs> Oh, hang on. It was so much fun the first time, you know? Like, I absolutely nailed it the first time, so I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll, let's do that again. Let's, let's do that again. Shit, the boxes of health haven't respawned. Now the enemies aren't dropping health. What? Why? <laughs> okay, I think I'm just gonna die again. I think that's probably <laughs> what's, just what, what's gonna happen. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm not even going to say, did I achieve anything? No.
Wait, how am I already... How was I already not at full health? What, like, what, what happened to me? Well, I like, black out or something, then that's why I, like, <laughs> not on full health. Ah, yes, you have to put it down in this very, very, very specific spot. Otherwise, you can only throw. So for say like that you did a little bit earlier, but like I threw the barrel and it just went haha no completely missed. Like even though I definitely hit it. I was so worried it was just gonna do that again. Oh <laughs> Absolutely livid. I still reckon definitely could have made that jump, but whatever. And that's one of the things that's kind of weird about this game is it kind of, it's a bit weird with the jump, you know? Like, obviously, like, there's no just dedicated jump button. There's no just, like, you know, press this to jump. But it also isn't, like, quite like the old 3D Zeldas. I say the old, every, like, you know, the non-Breath of the Wild 3D Zeldas. Where, like, you know, if you just run off an edge, you will jump. Because there are just some edges where it just goes, no. Nah. No jumping, you will fall off this edge. But then there are some ledges where it will be completely fine with you jumping off of them. And it's not a matter of, like, it's, it's weird because it's not a matter of, like, oh, you know, we don't want you to take fall damage. Because you can jump off one, or you can fall off ones, but you will take fall damage. But you, you know, where you'll still take fall damage. Um. And there are definitely ones where you jump off and you won't take full damage, you know? Oh, well, they, they won't let you jump off, but you definitely wouldn't take full damage from it. So it's all very weird and slight. I don't know if it like actually is consistent. I guess I haven't like taken note enough of it. It's just to be like, well, he's just in quite fake. But yeah, it, it feels very inconsistent. It feels like... Yeah, not even in, not necessarily inconsistent. It's more just so like there are times when the game is like, no, you can't jump here, or, or more specifically, 
yeah, okay, you can jump here. And anywhere else is sort of a no, you just sort of dangle off the ledge. Like here, like, I'm not going to take full damage from this. But he wouldn't let me jump off of it. Whereas it did let me fall off of that, even though I took fall damage. So it, it's like not as just as simple as like, oh, it doesn't want you taking fall damage or something like that. It's very, it's just very bizarre. Like, I feel like it's just this sort of like, I don't know. <laughs> they don't let you jump off like complex surfaces or something. I, I, yeah, I don't get it. And like, it feels like it's just sort of a very minor thing to be like, to pick up on and be like oh look at me i'm gonna make a point about it but i don't know it definitely sort of like i guess kind of kills a sense of like flow that you may have anyway here's a boss And if you want to think of like how little I fucking knew about this game, I didn't know this game had boss fight. Like I, I think there was like a bit where I was like, I was wondering earlier. I was thinking to myself like, does this game has boss fights or does like is there just like the final fight? Like does it just have the ending? Like fight, I guess. Yeah, I, I, I get. I guess it does have boss fight. Okay, I need to like stay, stay there and get, please. He's shitting. How exactly am I supposed to like get up to that? I'm only really missing something here. Thank you. 
I don't know, like, I, I don't know, I can, like, be eaten by him again. But I have, like, I don't know, I, I don't have any other, like, moves. <laughs> like, I, I have close range to hit him with the staff and long range shoot him with the staff. And I don't know, if I if I go in for the close range, I promptly eat shit. But the long range seems to do nothing. <laughs> Furry tentacle for <laughs> This game has everything. <laughs> Ah, what, what, what's next on like the <laughs> on the on the internet kink bingo? <laughs> also, something else that's like very weird is um Flame. the the game like unequip whatever you have on like He's your quick life slot. Every time you die, <laughs> which I'm sure for you know people who aren't me and aren't dog shit at this game, it's probably fine. <laughs> you probably don't notice and or care. Fireflies? No, oh, these are like weird little poison things. Yeah, I don't, I don't think it wants you to use the the long range attack because if they do, they do not give you sufficient like refills of it. <laughs> Then <laughs> now, 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 why did I have to read that? Okay, like what? Like what? Why did you have to type that? Why did I have to read that? <laughs> uh, maybe I don't know. Maybe they give you. No, they they might want you to do. Long range, they give you some. Not a whole fucking lot. Oh, oh, there we go. Um, I don't know why he did it that time because he just fucking didn't do it the other time. Yeah, yeah, fucking let's quit the game. <laughs> this game fucking sucks, donkey dick. Fucking bye bye. <laughs> This is 
how, how, how's that work? It was like, like, I don't know. Is that supposed to be like uvula and the fucking soul stone is in the uvula? What? Like, I don't know enough about like anything to fucking know how this works, but it doesn't feel right. Oh fuck, I don't have any fucking... I don't like recollect my fucking magic. Good. I completely missed when he... Oh no, fucking opens up his... Thrusty. <laughs> you had to look up what uvula was. It sounded really sexual and I was really confused. Yeah, no, you're, you're thinking of the vulva. <laughs> uh, the, uh, the uvula is that little, the, the little dangly bit in the back of your throat. Sorry, what hit me then? Okay, that just does like a whole fucking heart of damage. And then what the fuck am I hitting it on? Oh, okay, because it like fucking stayed. Jesus Christ. Ooh, go away. I've done like one good yeah just take like a whole fucking heart off me good I've done fucking <laughs> half the health of that hey miss ba Baxel how are you doing today Jumped again. I didn't feel like I did that successful. I felt like it ended on me getting hit. Genuinely surprised the boss ended there because uh, <laughs> Oh, you must forgive your father because that, uh, that, that, that didn't go by the rule of three Which is interesting scales, Like I know okay like rule of three isn't like 100% necessary for this sort of thing because of you but I don't know like shall no longer live as Rareware space. definitely likes their rule of three Okay, um, we'll see you soon we gotta take this spell stone Especially, like, I, I think the, the the game that comes to mind most, I think when I think of their, like, how much Rareware likes the rule of three, Conquer. Um, 
Congo Bad Fur Day has like a tons of fucking like rule of three moments in it of just like you were tasked three times. So that's very. <laughs> I was like, oh god, they, this, but the boss fight's not gonna be over yet. There's gonna be like one more like phase and like, oh no, it's finished. Huh. <laughs> Fuck that boss fight. I'm glad it's over. <laughs> <laughs> like, thank god they didn't use the rule of three. I'm fucking ready for it to be done. Great job, Fox! You saved the Snow Hall tribe and collected the Spell Stone. But it's not over yet. You need to return the Spell Stone to the Fourth Point Temple. Peppy has indicated that it is located beyond Moon Mountain Pass. I'm sure the Thorntails can point you in the right direction. Pepper out! Very weird, because obviously, like, with this being a Star Fox game, you really should expect, like, the flying segment. Like, you know, like, obviously, like, like, <laughs> like, like, that's the funny thing, like, that's why people who, like, you know, who played the first few Star Fox, the first couple Star Fox games didn't like this one, because, like, you know, it wasn't about the flying sections. But then, like, when actually playing this, it's like, man, the flying sections really just feel hacked on, like, <laughs> like, they just really feel kind of jarring and weird being here. But the fact, like, you know, you feel like, well, like, well yeah, they, they should be, like, flying sections. The Star Fox. What? <laughs> flying? This isn't what Star Fox is about. I played this game 15 years ago, but still remember it. <laughs> that's, that's better than I did. I, I I think I played this game when I was a kid, which is probably, probably close to, like, you know, sort of 15 years as well, really. Um, I don't, I don't remember a lick about it. <laughs> like, I, I remember I got stuck on one of, like, the, um, the weird little trials that you had to do. You've got to help us. Those horrible shark claws put out a lot of beacons, and it gets too dark at night. We be scared of the dark. <laughs> okay, okay, stop crying. I'll see what I can do. Don't forget about the spell stone, Fox. You have to return it to the first point, Devil. Where are we going? Where's the Force Point Temple? Peppy here! Check the detail readout, Fox! I think it might help you! Fox! I, I hope my. No, no, you won't, Peppy. I see you have found the spell stone. Now. Take it to one of the Force Point Temples that lie beyond Moon Mountain Pass and Cape Claw. Okay. Hi, Fox. Hi, well, that <laughs> Oh, hi, Fox. How you doing? <laughs> hi, Peppy. <laughs> yes, I'm not allowed to know where, like, Cape Claw Scanners. is because I haven't been there yet. Scanners indicate that this is your current position. Okay. Um. Very weird. I can't. I can't tell whether or not this is like a good place to call it for the evening. Because it's like, oh well, we just beat a boss fight. That makes sense. But then it's like, oh, but we haven't like. I don't know. We we still got to like give an item to a thing and go somewhere with the thing we got from the. I don't know. <laughs> You don't remember anything but bits of it. You got stuck at some levels, yeah. <laughs> I mean, for, I'm, I'm getting stuck now. <laughs> and, yeah. It certainly shouldn't be, but... <laughs> I'm gonna spend some money, because I got Max Wallet. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> you think I should continue for a bit? Oh, all right. Um, actually, I think I did buy it. I think it was the, the uh, what was it? No. I hope my information oh, wait, no, 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 that is what I wanted. It was Moon Mountain Pass that we bought. Yeah. Okay. So I should, I guess, be able to go there then. No, I know. I still don't want to spend some money though. I still got, still got max money. Fuel cell. Mm. Isn't probably maps might end up being the best thing to buy. I also did mention Cape Claw. So. I really worn this guy down at the beginning. It's like, no, he will not haggle at all. No, and then eventually he just, eventually he just kind of gives up. <laughs> and I guess we're going to get Crossover Palace eventually. <laughs> yeah, it's too low. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What happens if we shoot into that trash shooting? I haven't tried shooting him. A big fat nothing! So yeah, so I'm pretty sure he has a thing where like if um, I think like if you, well, well, we'll, we'll assume it's you know three because of the classic rule of three, but I think like if you um, if you go too low on the haggles enough times, I think he just refuses to sell you anything whilst you're in the shop. Like I, I think you have to like leave and then come back or something <laughs> for him to like actually start trying to sell you things again. Yeah, dark ice mines. I, I, mines? Hmm. I guess we don't need that one then. <laughs> That'd be like the one map that I was just like, I, I don't need that anymore. Okay, I'll sell it to you. Some of these are just like there's places that I just probably won't go for so long in the game. But I'm just like, oh, I've got money. I'll just buy all the fucking maps now. <laughs> you pay this much. Okay, I'll sell it to you. An expensive one. Okay, I'll sell it to you. Hi, Fox. We're all back. Keep going. So the, yeah, so there's the dark ice, dark ice mines map, which I don't think we need. Like I very much doubt we're gonna go back there. I feel like those are very much like, though it's almost like I, I feel like they're almost like the dungeons in Zelda. You know, it's like oh you know, you've just like we cleared that dungeon. There's not really a point in going back. So uh, you know, we we don't need the map for that. So that's 
think. I think it's down here that we want to go. I thought the other one was going to be closer. Well, I thought the one I jumped to was going to be closer. How am I back here? I felt like it put me a bit far away, but okay. That's the thing though, I didn't get like a key for this place. Like, I don't know, like I didn't get... No, there was like a key to go up in the thing here. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't get a key. Oh. I was like wondering where the barrels were. Yeah, no key. Slippy here. Okay, you're fucking useless. The people go, oh, go to like the moon fucking mountain pass. Okay. Uh, uh, Peppy, where should I go on the map? Oh, go to Thorntail Hollow. Are you sure? Because everybody at Thorntail Hollow is telling me to go to moon mountain pass. Yep. Hey, Slippy, do you have any better advice? No, look at the map. Like, uh, to try looking at Peppy's map. Oh god, you fucking... You are being useless right now. <laughs> You're both being very useless to me. Apparently, fucking Tricky didn't even come with me. <laughs> it's like, Fox, wait up! That's a very bizarre thing. Though. Like, they let you go there so early, and then they just go, No, you, you haven't got a key. No. <laughs> go away. Maybe I gotta do, like, I don't know, that beacon thing that they wanted. I'm sorry, why didn't that work? Light the beacons. Okay, fire. No. <laughs> you, you daft bastard. That's, that's not what we meant. <laughs> what? Have you seen our fireweed tree yet? Oh no, of course. I, I've got to do the fucking fireweed tree. That, that was, that's what you got to do. You, got, you can't use fire. I'm a fucking idiot for thinking so. No, of course, you gotta use the fire weed. So can you do like with the thing that you did with the other guy where you just take it to the thing? But these look like they're acting very stupidly. <laughs> Fine. 
Okay, don't know what they want out of that. <laughs> okay, that was like I have a reasonable guess as to what they want out of that, but mm, they're being dumb. <laughs> I guess I've got to get like another power or something. Because it. I, I don't know, because like fire really made sense. But the fact that like the C is like crossed out, to me suggests I don't have the ability to do that. Like whatever they're wanting me to do, I can't currently do. You have found the spell stone. Now, take it to one of the Force Point temples that lie beyond Moon Mountain Pass at Cape Claw. There are more of those trees. Do you mean the. what, the fireweed trees? See me, but the fucking game won't let me. <laughs> hmm. The sharp claw extinguished the flames. The tribe is doomed. Yes, okay. So I guess I, I, definitely, I, I guess I've definitely got to use them then. You can't really kick these like you can the frost ones. It's difficult because it's like, okay, like if that's what you're supposed to do, it's like, I get that, 
But it, at the same time, it doesn't feel like it's allowing me to do that, you know? It feels like it hasn't given me a feasible way to use the fireweed tree. It's just like, no, you know, <laughs> if you touch the fireweed, you take damage. feel like it, Pepe, I'll be completely honest with you. It feels like I'm sucking a fat fucking cock at this game. <laughs> I feel like I genuinely haven't, but like, I, I, it, it, it's boring. Because uh, I'm not sure it's like, man, is this just a game or am I having like a really fucking bad night, you know? Like, am I doing fucking atrociously just in, like in general? <laughs> things I do. Yeah, why, why, why just not jump? Do they like run away from you? Is that supposed to be the thing? Like you're uh, essentially, I don't know, supposed to like lead them to the thing by just. In my left. Oh, this is it. I've already. I feel like I've already been up here. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, so. Okay, right. I just stay here. <laughs> if, I, if I keep moving around, directions will get confusing. So where, 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 do, where do they need to go from here? By the window, by the dino. Over here? By this one. Yeah? Another dino by a window. I mean, that's... Is it like... Yeah? Okay, well, thanks for hanging out, Decca. <laughs> Whether or not I'll still be streaming. Gosh, well, I, I don't know. <laughs> Depends on how long this takes me, I guess. I swear I fucking did this. Like, I definitely hit these. I swear I've hit these. Ugh. Jesus, god damn it. This <laughs> is just like, man. This feels like a combination of just me being an idiot and the game not exactly communicating that well. Jesus. Doesn't help that they fucking run away from you. <laughs> okay. Ah. I guess that's why they weren't like lighting up, I guess. Flame. That's all right. I mean, it's like a little bit difficult, like, you know, anyway, just just because of like, you know, streamer and chat delay. <laughs> the when, when someone's like, oh, it's like there. And I'm like, oh shit, I've already like moved in a completely different direction now. <laughs> I'm like facing a completely different direction to when they said that. <laughs> I don't actually know if there's another one. Those are like the only two I've seen. This is a bad and I'm guessing there's more. I 
the one that they like right at the end, maybe? I feel like I remember seeing one down here for some reason. No, but there is a switch. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's what lets me go down there. Hey, can you like wake up? I gotta see if I'm done. Considering everyone's gonna be like, oh, I can barely sleep. I don't know, man. You seem to be sleeping fucking perfectly fine. <laughs> the one down here, I don't fucking remember. No, there wasn't one down here. So there's gotta be another one somewhere, where the fuck is it? So like, are they going like, um... No, when you look up things about the map, it's like, oh, zoom out and you'll see all sorts of secrets. It's like, you really fucking won't. <laughs> you will see fuck all on the map if you zoom out. seen where any of the other beacons are? Oops, sorry dude. Please light our beacons. Dude, I'd love to, but I have no idea where any of the others are. <laughs> and no one is telling me. I'm gonna be like down here, is it? That wouldn't make sense. How will we ever relight the beacons? Actually, fucking is down here. <laughs> Flame. The beacons mean so much to my tribe. <laughs> Please take this. I believe it will help you on your quest. Hey, if that's for the fucking Moon Mountain Pass, then you should have given that to me anyway. <laughs> yes, okay. Ah. Okay. Ah, right. Feels like we're actually back to making progress for a little bit. Same thing I did last time. Where are we going? <laughs> okay, well, thank you for stopping by, Miss Baxel, and, th and thank you for the help. <laughs> I greatly appreciate it. Have a good night.
<sighs> right. <laughs> I'm still a little bit worried that they're just gonna go like, Oh look, it's another dungeon, lol. I was like, oh god, no, please. <laughs> Gonna kill those two guys throwing barrels. Oh shit, a different enemy. Money wasted. Ah, yes, thank you. It doesn't even look like there's anything on the other end of this, but no, there is. Oh, yes, I know. I, yep. We sure are in Moon Mountain Path. I believe you, game. Okay, well, I mean, this is looking... This is beginning to look like, uh, you know, like a whole nother dungeon. I don't know if it is. But I'm very much starting to think maybe I should call it here. I have two buff arm dads with me now. Yeah, four, four. This is where we're supposed to be going, isn't it? I don't know, the game's decided to stop telling me. <laughs> Those against like, I uh, you know, fucking, I'm not telling you anymore. Well, it's, it's, it's one of the false point temples I think we're supposed to go to. the orbs of the Krizoa may pass.
Thank you. And basically it's just the free health for falling down here. <laughs> I was like, wow, you fell down here. All right, go on, have some health. I'll help you back up. I mean that doesn't actually make sense like if it was a like like it makes sense when you do it with like a bow and arrow doesn't really make sense if you just do it with like a, a, a magic thingy does it <laughs> this game is so very weird it feels like like obviously it's very zelda like but i feel like it misses like a few things like a few things about, you know, why, like, what makes Zelda good. And I guess, like, at, at the time of this, what, there would have only been, like, in terms of 3D Zeldas, there would have only been Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. I don't think Wind Waker would have been out yet. But it could have been. I'm not entirely, I don't remember when Wind Waker came out. But I guess, like, even then, like, Wind Waker would have been, like, even if they did come out like at roughly the same time, they would have been worked on like at the same time. But, you know, so they only really had like Majora's Mask and Ocarina of Time to go off of. Um, I know this is very weird. It feels like you know, like they wanted to do their own sort of style Zelda game, but they just. I really just like missed a few of the parts as to why it works only he who dims the flames of Twirdoa may pass Dim the flame, also known as light the flame. Got my wallet full already. Yeah. 
Yeah, um, I'm not entirely sure there was a whole lot of dimming flame there. <laughs> Unless we were like about to dim some flames, I don't know. So I'm like, we fucking better. <laughs> You collect the ice blast. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> use it to douse flames and freeze bad guys. There we go. Fucking doubt it, this mate. temple has been built on a force point. A point where pure magical energy is forced up from within the core of the planet. This energy is so powerful that it continually attempts to break the planet apart. To stop this, the ancient Crusoe placed two spell stones inside the temple to absorb the energy. When General Scales removed the stones, planet began to fall apart by returning ah. the small stones back to the temple you will bring the planet together once more peppy out which stones are going to use the stone and then it just like goes back into my inventory <laughs> i keep thinking it's like oh, okay this is where the stone is gonna go and then she goes like no lol Like, is this the way we came from? I don't think so. But I don't know. <laughs> and the door won't open. I want the door open. Thank you. 
I was like putting these out. I was like, I don't even fucking know if they still want me to put these out. I guess they did. to fire. <laughs> Oh god, I'm just gonna get a fucking decked by these annoying fucking bird creatures. Where are we going? <laughs> Dude, I don't fucking know where we are. I mean, that was bizarre. Entered from one area, it faced us the wrong way, and it wasn't even in, like, the right... for, like, the right, like, slot. Okay, well those guys are refusing to die. I mean I might die in a second. It might be a little bit longer now. Hooray. Okay, second back. <laughs> Yes, use a fucking buff on that.
Okay, I guess my question is how the fuck did I get up there? <laughs> Oh, I fucking, yeah, I'm in a fucking barrel alley. <laughs> Die faster, please. Can you hear that? <laughs> Akrazoa. Do you wish to accept our test? Fucking no, what mate. I wish to go to fucking bed. <laughs> I was released when she completed my test, but she is now in great danger, and for her to survive, you must continue what she started, and collect the remaining Krizoa spirits, for only the pure of heart can enter our shrines. I can't just stop now to save this stranger. The planet is falling apart. <laughs> Damn, she being Sounds choked like too. To trouble, Fox. Find the remaining five Krizoa shrines. Complete the test within each, and bring the spirits to Krizoa Palace. The warp stone can get you there. When all spirits are returned, she will be saved. She is depending on you for her life. Defeat the creature to collect a moon seed. I guess we'd better help her. Yeah, I wonder if this game was like well received, how much of like uh, like the fucking Star Fox lore this would have continued. I mean, they they kept Crystal. Well, like how much else of the Star Fox lore would have been like? Uh, kept over from this. Huh. I mean, I, I, I guess that's the thing that, like, really only, like, I don't know, like, I, obviously I, I I don't really know if the other Star Fox games do it as well, but the kind of thing that, like, the Star Fox series lends itself well to is the fact that, like, oh, you know, they're a team of mercenaries, like, space mercenaries. They can go wherever the fuck they want, like, you know. It really is, like, a wasted opportunity for them to just always be, like, you know, save the lilac system sort of thing like obviously yeah i get you yeah, i get i get you saving the lilac system but i mean like you know it's always like oh you torn area and shit like that and the same same sort of places where it's like oh this this was like in the far reaches of the lilacs and like on the edge of the lilac system that nobody gives a fuck about sort of thing there's something near flame Yeah, so I feel like it, it's weird how like it lends itself well to this idea of like, you know, they could go anywhere. They could, they can explore like all these different like planets and civilizations and areas. But like, as I said, like I don't really know if Assault or Command to do this as well. But like this is the only one I know of that does it. Flame. 
same. Oh wait, no, this is a fucking planting spot, Jesus. <laughs> I'm like so just in the sort of mindset of like, yeah, it's, it's like this thing. We're, we're doing this thing at the moment. I'm like, oh no, wait, we, we're doing something else for a second. <laughs> Okay, is there like a clear like what I'm supposed to do like whenever this section ends sort of bit? Because it feels like it really just just keeps going like one more thing and it's like dude no <laughs> just like get to like a nice clear sort of da -da -da -da, you did it Now go and do the next one so I can you know end <laughs> Huh? 
This is the fucking rock. What am I supposed to do with the rock? Ah, it's an explosive rock. I guess I gotta throw these somewhere. But that's not entirely clear where yet. Thanks, asshole. Oh yeah, that guy, I guess. Maybe. Hey, Deco, welcome back. <laughs> yeah, long stream today. Yeah, we still go. The game refuses to give me a, a good, nice, clean ending point for the stream. <laughs> Where the fuck did that guy go? There he is. Oh, for fuck's sake. Like, I wouldn't mind doing these long streams, or these slightly longer streams. I, just, I, I, I think I'm usually just like to sort of know whether or not I'm going in for that. <laughs> like, you know, like if I, if I, if I know like a one-off is going to be like six hours or something, then I'm kind of fine with that. <laughs> Tricky slam so weird for dude, I think it's like a kid in a, the kids in a 90s toy commercial, yeah. Okay, Slippy, what, what? Slippy here! Got yourself stuck again? Get the fuck up. Try plugging the holes. Okay. okay. You can get like me like Yeah. yeah. I, I think I've I've hit fucking slippy more than I have those fucking guys. Fucking demolished. <laughs> Flippy here. Having a dumb dumb moment, Fox. A little bit brainless, clueless, maybe, Fox. It feels like that. <laughs> His fucking voice does not help. It really just it makes you feel like such a dumb motherfucker when you press that like slippy button. God damn it. I feel like this game is a little bit obtuse. So I'm like, nah, man, I fucking gotta press that slippy button. I think like, even just to see if, like, I'm in the right place. <laughs> Why am I running to collect that? I can't fucking do anything with it. Okay, so I think there are supposed to be more of those, like, no things, like holes to plug. Because I'm not plugging the right ones. Uh, what did he fucking say? Slippy here. Got yourself stuck again? Fucking, okay. He, he, he genuinely said something less useful that time. Yeah, I'm gonna try well, this one where there's only three. No, no, okay. Because there's. It wouldn't let me put them down there. Well, I guess there's more so somewhere else then?
I don't know, they didn't introduce those weird little rocks until after this section. But then, you know. Why am I pretending like is anything in this game is that, you know, well done? <laughs> Like, don't get me wrong. I like Rare. I like Rare where I think they've, they've done some good stuff. I ain't so sure about this one. <laughs> Did I not kill you or are you just respawning? Okay, so you gotta like put it on the right ones, and I just, I just went like by sheer just like the universe having a big fuck you moment. I put them on all of the wrong ones. Like, <laughs> like you're supposed to like figure out which ones to put it on, and just through sheer coincidence, I put them on all of the wrong. Like, uh, Man, like you think it may be throwing me like a little bone, uh, but no, <laughs> even the universe is japing me now. <laughs> I, fucking, I fucking hate these little gremlin guys. Flying enemies in this game suck. Okay, they fucking... They fucking suck. Flame. <laughs> Was that not literally the sound say? It's very close, yeah. They even do that for just like really simple things like, ah, oh, you put like the box, like the movable box in the right spot. Da -da 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 -da. Killed so many of these guys. I like I, I'm I'm already prepared for like when they when they went like oh and then just like do some more stuff. Oh he's fucking hungry. Okay. Yeah, have some food. I'm stuck. <laughs> Flame. Fucking another one of these fucking cheap. You know what? Fucking yeah, I'll fucking I've got spare money. I've got, like fucking have my fucking money. I've got a full wallet and I don't give a fuck. Take it to the maze. Okay, well I'm never fucking gonna do that, but I guess I've got the cheap token because why not?
Yeah, I, I like his, his his movement when he's like, I don't know, on like vines or um, stone or something. Well, like he's not just on it. Like his ladder movement is fine, but he's always like. <laughs> Yeah, you know, and I've already made them like half the money back that I paid for the fucking cheat token. I have no idea what it does. Oh, good. get fucking whacked by a jellyfish whilst the fucking cutscene's happening. I was like, hey, I bet you these are one these are the platforms that you can fall off of. When like, you know, you, oh, you couldn't fall off of that like one tiny bit above like the barrel conveyor belt or whatever. Nope, nope. You, if you fell off that, you had to like fucking fucking hang on to the thing. Oh, good, yes. Be on Firefox. Be on Firefox. This stream is brought to you by Firefox. I don't know why they do a stream because I'm pretty sh No, are they open source? I don't know. So what was I supposed to like? Was I supposed to hit a switch or something before I came here? Ow. No, I'm clearly not in the... Clearly not in the range of the fire, but you know, whatever helps you sleep at night game. Alright, fine, fucking just fall. you are in the range of fire. Well, I disagree. I'm entirely sure what it wants from me here, I'll be honest. I'm sorry, why was that fall damage? I'm sorry, I mean, I mean... <laughs> I'm hitting like the bitchy part of the night. I'm, I've been streaming this game for so long. I'm, I've gone into full fucking like, you know, gamer rage mode. I gotta, we, we gotta chill, okay? We gotta not, not, not let the final part of this game, the final part of this game, I'm not even anywhere fucking close to the end of the game. <laughs> not let the final part of the evening get to us. Oh, there's gonna be a button over there. Fox, you silly motherfucker. I don't did, like, okay. I definitely didn't take fall damage a few times when I fell off these ledges. And now all of a sudden I'm taking fall damage. Um.
No, I don't even care about being on fire. Why am I on double fire? <laughs> uh, no worries, Decker. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, I, I need a fucking sleep too. <laughs> oh, jeez, I made it with one fucking yeah. HP left. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out, Decker. Have a good night. Test 2 The Test of Combat. Prove your worth in combat by defeating all the sharp claw within the time. If you succeed, I will become yours to return to the Quidoa Palace. Oh, I was gonna say, can I have a bit of health? But I guess the answer is no. <laughs> Keep doing this. Oh. Okay. Oh shit, I, <laughs> I somehow got some health from that. I don't know why. Fight like the other guy. Actually, this guy's pretty low on health. Good. I kind of wasn't expecting to do that, I'll be completely honest. <laughs> Considering I started that on one sliver of health left. Collected the second Crusoe spirit will remain in your body until you take it to the Crusoe Pass where it must be released. Okay, fuck it. <laughs> I'm saving here. I'm, I'm saving here and we'll take it to fucking Crusoe Palace next time. <laughs> If I could not play this again for a bit, <laughs> which um, yeah, we'll continue. We'll be continuing this on Friday, uh, maybe Friday. Actually, I don't quite know that. That might be subject to change. We'll see. Uh, but the next stream will be Wednesday, um, with more Kirby and the Forgotten Land. So that is that will be what's coming up next. And coming on the rest of this week on the stream. Um, if you miss the stream and you want to catch up, then you can head on over to the Uber Archive um, over on YouTube, or you can go to the highlights page on my Twitch where you can catch up alongside the chat. Um, I also have a main YouTube channel, um, which, you know, I'm actually a little bit using at the moment. You know, I uploaded uh, a nice little short clip from the Kirby stream that we had on Friday. I uploaded that just the other day. Um, and I, I, I'm going to have a video out later this week as well. Uh, I'm going to have a nice little video coming out. So, you know, actually keep an eye out on my YouTube channel for a, for a bit. And I'm also on Twitter if you care about that or if you do, you know, if you just want to get notified of the stream shit. And I also have music. Yes, I have my very own music that I have released under me, Connor Alexander. You can find it by searching for Connor Alexander on streaming services. Uh, my debut EP, All Right, is out now. It's been out for... Guys, it's, it's going to be two months tomorrow, actually. It's going to be two months old tomorrow, so... Yay! It's happy birthday. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, you can check that out uh, on you know, Spotify and all those other streaming services. Or you can go to Bandcamp, where you can download it. It's name your price, so you can have it for free if you want to. Or you can send a little bit of money my way. I think it's worth a little bit of money, but that's just me. That's, you know, me who still buys music. 
you, you can find that conoralexmusic.bandcamp.com and i'm also on twitter for music as well Connor Alex music on twitter where you know i talk about uh you know my music how you know i'm working on an album at the moment so i'll occasionally try and keep you up to date with that and also just the music i'm listening to and thoughts about music um i was at a concert last night so you know i sort of tweeted tweeted about that i had a few tweets about the about the gig that i was at so you know, if you like that sort of thing you want if you really like music it's a it's a music twitter connor alex music on twitter anyway that's gonna be it for me so we're gonna be doing more of this on friday no don't know if it's friday maybe friday maybe not i don't actually know yet but we will be doing kirby on wednesday uh so thank you all for watching and hanging out for this little bit little bit extra than long stream uh but i appreciate it as always um so thank you and i hope you have a good one bye